You are about to leave for fishing? Yes. Okay, that's good. But uh, why don't you wait for me to finish up with this cook? <laughs> Mama, don't worry, I will eat when I return. Eh. Yes, okay, please ensure you come back on time so that you can have a taste of this. Where are they? I want to take my time to prepare. Where, where is that stupid woman at all? Jama. Stop calling us stupid. We are not stupid. Please, please, please. I have come for my money. And I'm not leaving this compound today without my money. And I'm here Give me my money. Ijoma, Ijoma, Ijoma. Ijoma, you are my niece. You are my sister. I know we are owing you. But as it is right now, there is no money available. But I am promising you that by the end of the month, you will have your money. Please, I am not here for that. I'm not here for that at all. I am here for my money. Please give me my money. Ijama, there is no money. Do your worst. I should do my worst. Yes, do your worst. See, Don't even you are daring me, Ijama. Do your worst. No you are money. daring me. There is no money. No, I will go there. Can you imagine? Please pay me my money. I said there is no money. Do your worst. You are daring me, the lioness. lioness. You are daring me. We kill lion. Talk more of lioness. My friend, if you don't you live here, for me. Leave here. you will hear for me, both of you. Leave your advice. You know look your face. Look look we are all in. relax. <laughs> yeah, Joma, if you get me angry, I will dismantle you here and refix you. What's your problem? We are all here, so. We are all here. Mama, I will go. Relax. Have a nice day. Hey, Hi. Hi. Don't make it too tiny. Like that. Oh, you're not big enough. You're not tiny. <laughs> Let it have space. Have space. Mm -hmm. You want to wear bogus? Might I like give you my costume? I don't want any mistakes, so. I've told you, there will be no mistakes. Yeah? I will give you the best. I'm a designer, I'm not a tailor. I can sew anything. I can sew anything. You're not, you're not machine. My princess, I know you must have missed home so much after being a room for a whole year for your national service. Princess Kaima, you have not seen anything. You don't look happy. Are you not happy to be back home? Home is a place of absolute freedom, not a place where one is caged, forced to wear certain apparels and ornaments. Restricted from engaging in what makes one happy. I wish the service days last forever. Are you kidding? How can a princess of a proud community like Umuno feel this way about herself and her community? I am being pragmatic about this. There is no point faking how I feel. My princess. 
Permit me, please. You know, the word outside royalty, wealth and power is very, very rough and cold. You will not understand this until you are soaked in our own kind of world. Please be patient. I know your father the king. He can do anything for you. He can do anything to make you happy. Patience is for those who do not know what they want in life. If you know what you want, you go for it. Not waiting for it to come after you. Princess. So now, how do you want those who admire you and want to be a princess like you? How do you want them to feel? I never wished to live a life of pretense as a princess. My dream has always been to be myself and be free. Not this type of life. Not the life where I am caged. Where I barely take decisions for myself. Now I have to pretend in doing this, even when it doesn't go well with my definition of simple life. This is one thing I have tried to shy away from, making me a demigoddess before the people. No one tells me the truth because they fear I may react badly. Some even tremble when my countenance changes towards them. God. I wish I gain total freedom someday when I won't be held bound to the traditions of the palace. Father, I am back. Kai Majugu, this is great. Thank you, Father. <sighs> Welcome, Princess. My love. Thank you for being here. Alright, camera, come on. Come on. Come on. Are you off to? I want to go and see my friend Chizoba. All right, but do not stay too long, eh? I will not. Thank you, Father. Uh, Chihuahua, uh, you follow her. I don't want anyone to go with me. Can I go alone? Palace standing rule. Dad, I know. But while I was away, I had nobody going everywhere with me. I can still do that now. Please. Okay, fine. Can, can I go with only Chihuahua? The rest can just focus on their chores.
are still working. And yeah, what else are we going to do? We are now at Google Post. Hmm. Life can be very interesting at times. Very, very interesting. I don't get it. Oh, Adap, do you understand what she's saying or trying to say? I hope that one. I don't get it either. Okay, this is what I mean. How can someone who is so fortunate be praying to be like a commoner? Oh, you mean the princess and the drama she played earlier on? Who else? Well, she has lived and experienced a life outside this palace. Don't you think the palace will look like a prison to her since she doesn't have her privacy anymore? Don't you think? Would you? You can't walk in. Can you hear yourself? Now tell me, what about the flamboyancy? Was the Igwe not sending her money when she was in service? Answer me. Can you get me so? Uju, come to your regard, you go so good. Let me be honest with you. You see, Princess Kaima, if she faces real poverty, she will never wish to be a common. When I say poverty, I mean Obonyo no to her. The type our family is facing, if not for the fact that we are lucky to be in this palace. Baby, our body for don't tell us. Anyways, you are right. If she have faced real hunger, <laughs> I mean real hunger, she won't be saying all that now. Mba no no, she won't. This is a typical example of those who have head don't have car. Okay? Eh? Hey! I wish I am the one in her position. You see my shoulder? You know me now. You see my shoulder? Hey! I beg you. I beg you. I beg you. I You are your eye to open. Come on, why are you going to continue with our work? You don't go. What about you that come here to go see? My fine girl. My princess. I am so happy for you. Honestly. Thank you. You're welcome. And it's finally you've completed the required standard of a graduate. Mm -hmm. Your so own bad. is better. I mean, your own is better. Unlike me that went through hell to even finish my secondary education. Uh, uh? To complete my secondary education, it was, it was eh, very hard. So, but will you stop? Last, last, my presence. See where I am, man. See where I did. How can you even say that? You never understand. How can you talk down on yourself? You're doing amazingly well for yourself. Just take a good look at your shop. It's filled to the brim. Come on, Zoba. You're a boss of your own. Okay, now think about this. How many graduates can boast of getting a good job for themselves? Let's talk more of creating one. Think about it. You understand that you're doing so well. I envy you, my friend, but in a positive way. Don't even go there. If you see the stress I go through every day, I mean every blessed day, you won't even try envying me one bit. So you you go through such stress on a daily basis and you still look this beautiful. Please. Then you are your queen. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> stop. But that's not the reason I am here. So why? You, met, you remember the last time before I traveled for my service? You said, in fact, I quote, you promised to follow me to the river for a bath. No, my princess. That's why I'm here. As you can see, so I'm not done with this. Please. See, look at it. The customer will soon be here to pick it up. Okay. So, can we just a few hours stuff. It might not be. Just, okay, let's say 30 minutes. I'll just do this tomorrow. Then. Maybe tomorrow. No, please now. It took me a lot to convince my father to let me out of the palace. Wait. I'm telling you the truth. I, I begged and begged. He, even, he still had to send me out with somebody. You mean you can't still go out on your own without the company of the guards or beggars or all Now of that. you understand me, right? Please. Wow. This is, this is rather pathetic. It is I'm, what it I'm, is. I'm, I'm serious. Royal traditions. But it's then, hey, <laughs> good. You want us to go now? Are you going to swim like this? I'm sure. Whoa! Look at your shoes. Are you going it's to do it? Let me shock you. You shock me. <laughs> I came with my swimming trunk, my slippers, and some chips to spice it up. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Ah, you should have told me you're prepared from home. You didn't even call me. Ah, my 
Yeah. But I told you I was coming back, did I not? Okay, see, let me... My guess are not around, what do I do? Someone is going to come here to pick up the house. Chihuahua, you have to wait here, okay? No, my princess. I don't think that is advisable because the king told me to go with you whatever you're going but to. But I'm asking you to wait. At the end of the day, I am not going there alone. I intentionally asked Chizoba to excuse us so I can talk to you politely. Or do you want to see my nakedness? I'm asking you. No, my princess. This God. You walk. Do you have Jesus' number? No, Your Highness. Send for the rest of the gods yes, and the maidens as well. Yes, Your Highness. Don't. Do you have it? No, 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 you, you. Go to Chizoba's shop in search of the princess. If you get there and you do not see her, then bring to this palace whatever that is breathing there. Do I make myself clear? Yes, yes. Move now, move!
to her. What happened to her? She's a poor, she doesn't want to happen to her, but this guy, and she's about to be explained better. Young man, what did you do to my daughter? No, sir. Tell me what you did. I'm just a helper. I'm just a helper. Sir. I'm just a helper. I'm just a helper. What kind of helper? You're just a helper. Um, my princess fell inside the room. Hey, what am I going to do? Come on, come on, come on. Enter the car, enter the car. Put her in the car. Quickly. Open the car, open the car. daughter is suffering from what you call TBI. What? What's TBI? Um, it is traumatic brain injury. Yes, it usually occurs when um, when there is a crash, like an accident, or a severe trauma to the head. Yes, that affects uh, the score and invariably the brain, uh, causing some kind of shock to the brain. And um, the result of that is that um, the victim will have things like um, loss of memory, yes, um, even loss of consciousness. That's Romeva. This, uh, all these uh, medical jargons, I, I don't understand them. But let me ask, what is the way forward? Uh, um, all right, Your Highness. Uh, I have to state that the situation is severe. Yes, her case is quite serious. So I'm going to admit her for some days. I can't tell how many, but she has to be admitted so that proper medical diagnosis and care will be taken. Hmm. Doctor, um, my daughter's life is in your hands. Please take care of her. Take care of her. She is all I have. Huh? The cost, I don't care whatever it costs, I will bear it. I will pay you whatever it costs. Of course, Your Highness. Uh, you and I have come a long way. Yes, um, my oath of being a medical doctor is to save lives. And I have been doing that for years now. So you, you have nothing to worry about. Uh, but I have to point out, Your Highness, that uh, your daughter will require the presence of her loved ones to be able to recover quick from loss of memory. Mm. Yes, yeah, she needs people who discuss things that happened in the past so that uh, gradually she can begin to recollect her memory. It's welcome. Um, we will organize ourselves and uh, uh, we will show up. Hmm? We will always be there for her. She is my only child. So please, take care of yourself. You turned out that she is the princess of our land. Ah! Ekwala! Life. Princess, princess of this kingdom? The princess. She can move. But uh, the moment they rushed her to the hospital, I started coming back. Hey, yeah. Uh, mm. So, uh, how is she feeling now? I wouldn't know. I didn't. Uh, I left them now. Chai. I'm glad I did my part. Hey, you did well, my son. Yes, sir. You did well. You must be very hungry. Let me get you something to eat. Oh, no, don't stress. Let me just do garri and granat. Please you come. I'm fine now. That will be fine for you. Yes, sir. Don't worry. Princess of our land. About running. Hey! Your daughter will require the presence of her loved ones to be able to recover quick 
from loss of memory. Kaima, my daughter. See what you've got yourself into. Out of carelessness. May the gods of our fathers protect you. What about yes. her? Nothing happens to the princess. Chapa, my dear, if anything happens to her, I must finish her. Igwe will kill me the way I'm looking at it. Chihuahua, why won't you be finished? Huh? What were you thinking? Huh? Why will you take your eyes off the princess? My brother, it's not my fault. What is wrong with you? She's scolded and threatened to blackmail me. That I'm attempting to see her nudity. Then if you were in my shoe, what do you expect? What would I do? Right. Can everybody please just calm down? Everybody, please calm down. All we need now is serious prayers. Igwe is coming.
Mark Jamaica. It looks as if no one is around. Yes. I can take this file, sell it, and deposit the money to Oko the Habalis. Yes. Mm, that's what I'm going to do. When I sell it, I give it to Oko so that he can heal my daughter. Passing is somebody company. Huh? Is someone company. Uh, are you looking for? Just passing. Just passing. Mm. There's no road here. Hey, my tummy. What happened to your tummy? My tummy. tummy. It's aching me. My tummy. Let me Mother, go home. Huh? Eh? You are holding something. Mm. This is foul leg. I'm saying foul leg. Ah. Uh, hey, where? Look at it. Ah. Uh, look at it. For ground? No, in your hands. Uh. Bring it out. It's my tummy. Madam, bring it out. My tummy, I beg. It's my tummy. Do you Let want me to go. lose your weapon? Let me go. Bring it out, madam. It's my tummy. Madam, what to huh? that in? Hey! I beg, ma'am. Hey! Foul! Huh? You stole somebody foul. Uh -uh. Really? Uh -uh. Tifa! Tifa! Bianu, 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 oh sure! Madam! Where, 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 where? Hey! Where, 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 where? Where, 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 where? You see my foul. She's still my pal. She's still my pal. Match is over. It's an advantage. Hey. I can explain. I can explain, please. You are a disgrace to womanhood. Mm -hmm. But you know me, I don't steal. Hey. You steal. That's why you steal this pal. Ah, oh, Let me Let's go. take her to the village square. square. Please. You please. must go to the village square. Oh, yeah. Please. Take her, take her. Move. You stole my hey. phone! Oh, oh, you stole my phone! You stole my phone! Come, let's go! Please. Let's go to the village square. Go! Please. We must tie this phone. Ah. We must tie this phone. You're dead. is going on here? My princess. Greetings, my, my princess. princess. What is going on here? She stole a foul. Yes. She stole a foul. She stole a foul. Woman, why did you steal knowing the penalty? The princess, I'm not a thief. Shut up, you're a thief. Liar. Right. Thief. Mm. I did this so I can sell it and sell and save my daughter who has been sick and at the point of death. Ah, I was even coming to your house. What was it that you want us to talk about? You were coming to my house and I was also coming to your house. Biko, I came to beg you to lend me some money. My daughter is dying. She is dying. Uh -huh. Please lend me some money so I can save her life. Biko, Biko, please. Uh, 
Where do you want me to get that money from? I don't have any money. Kechi, don't tell me that now. Eh? I, I know, you and I know, you are the treasurer of uh, the women wing in this community. I know there should be some money in your hand, please. Just lend it to me, eh? I, I will pay you back, Biko. Oh, so this was what you want us to talk about? Uh -huh. eh. Ngozi, uh -huh. I don't want to take the risks. Hey! Please, I don't want to have problem with the women. Please, hey. please. Is it better that my daughter dies? Uh, would you like it if my daughter died? Please, please help me. You are my last hope, Biko. I, I believe you will not disappoint me, Biko. Please don't disappoint me. Samio, eh? Would you want my daughter to die? No, eh? no, no, no. Biko, no. Please, please. Your daughter will not die. Please don't call me a wicked woman. I, eh? I don't have that money. There's nothing I, there's nothing I can do for this. I, for, I don't have anything to do. Chai. On this, there is nothing. Chai. What? I don't have anything. Uh, if you carry me, go up. Bring me down. Nothing. Nothing. Please. Ukechi. Please. It's my daughter's life we are talking about here. I my know. daughter's life. I know. Because, you know. I don't have anything now. Eh? I, I, you are behaving as if I have. I don't want to give you. Please. Don't do that now. You shake another place, please. Because, you know. Go somewhere and ask for. They will give you. Please. Oh. Please now. Oh. I, I, since uh, you have discussed the reason of seeing me, uh, let me go back to my house. Oh, no. Because, uh, oh, Ketchi, please! Because it's me. Oh. I don't have money now. Bye-bye. Go, go, hey. go another person. Go another person. Oh, bye. Oh. Ketchi, it's me. Oh. Hey. Where do I go from here? Where do I go from here? Hey. Oh. Oh. I don't know. Hey, God, no. Uh, where are you rushing to? Chidi, I'm going about the whole community looking for money. My daughter, my daughter is very sick. Very, very sick. In fact, she's about to, in fact, she, she would die at any moment if I don't do anything. I'm looking for money to save her life, Biko. Is there any way you can help me? I wish you best of luck. Chidi, please come, please. Hey, Chidi, the way I'm begging you, you just want to leave. Please help me now. Any amount will help me, please. Please don't Hi. tell me no. My mouth is Oba. Uh? See, I don't have shishi Hello. to give you for your mother for your daughter's and sickness. Hi. And even if I get, uh. even if I get, uh. I will not give. Chai. Yes. But, but, but why? 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 Why are you saying this? You ask me why. It's Chizo Bao. Because I know that you and Chizo Bao are good friends. Huh? I know we are good friends. Just give me time. You know, see, I love you so much. See, yeah, by the time I was making money in, in this village, you will understand. See, I will face you. I will buy a car. I will make you, you look good. Just give me time. Well, um, Chidi, please. You just have to give me a little time. Just, just more time. I don't want to rush into a relationship that I will regret later. Oh, gee. You're not going to regret anything as far as Chidi is concerned. Just give me the time. I will take care of you. I'll take care of you, okay? I'll show you how caring I am as a man. Auntie, please, you have to get going. My mom will be looking for me. It's getting late already. Auntie, please. Please, okay? You know I love you so much. Just give me time. I want to go. Okay, fine. Can I see you off? No problem, if you wish to.
Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Zalba, how are you? My princess, I'm fine, thank you. Where are you heading to? Uh, my... We are going this side. No, 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 my princess, we are, we are just going somewhere. <laughs> Okay, I thought you were actually going home, so I would drop you. But, but I'm going this side. My brother, yes. All right, thank you. But, but, but we're going this side. I'll, I'll talk to you later. I don't understand. How? Bye-bye. I'll talk to you later, okay? How come? The princess, thank you. Okay. Jim! Hi! <laughs> Your daughter Chizopa is very, very stingy goat. Hey. Yes, all is stingy. Let her hold her thing while I hold my money. Even if I get, even if I get, I will never give and I can never give. Simple. She did. Yes. So we're talking about thing here in somebody's life. Chizoba, my daughter, who, eh? Okay, even if you don't want to help Chizoba, do it because of me. Biko. Biko. Please. Madame, we are doing to my daughter. If hey. she give me, I will give her. That is fine now. Come on. Hey, she did. Chidi! Oh, hey! She doesn't give her. Give me, I give her. That's why she refused to. That's why he refused to help me, to save Chizoba's life. Hey! Chidi! Oh, my God! Where will I go from here? Hey! Chizoba, one more. My princess. But woman! You know we don't welcome thieves in this community. Yes! Yes! yes. Oh, yeah. She's not a thief. You just heard her. She did what she did so she can actually save her child. My princess, don't mind her. We caught her stealing. Yes! yes. She yeah. must be born alive. Yes! yes. yes. Please, I'm not a thief, Stand out. princess. I am your princess. As the daughter of the king of this land, I have every right to set her free. Like I said before, she's not a thief. She did what she did to save her daughter. But my princess, you know we don't welcome thieves in this community. Yes, yes. Exactly. She must be punished for her crimes. Yes. Let her go. My people, you've heard the princess. Hand her over to the princess. Oh, disappear! Shame on you. Oh, Sophia, After begging me for money, the next thing you do is to go and steal your car. Sophia! Oh, she should forgive me. It's no intention now. Don't worry, you will take me to where your daughter is. Hey, madam, come for this. Is this yours? No, it's not mine. She cannot steal from me. She can never steal from me. Mm. Oh, see the owner. My princess, it's no intention. Mm -hmm. it's okay. Take me to your daughter. She's in the house. Take me to where she lives. Thank you, my Get princess. Into the My princess, that's how it all happened. Mama, it's okay. I understand your plight. But there is no justification to stealing or doing something wrong. Yes. What if I hadn't met you there in time? My princess, I'm not a thief. <laughs> I was so desperate. I've moved around the whole community looking for who will help me. Nobody agrees to help me. So I saw that thing as my last means. Mama, it's okay. It's... I'm not a thief. It just Mama, happened. Like I said before, there is no justification to stealing or doing something wrong. I will do my part and I will leave the rest for God. 
Thank you, my princess. Our only hope is that your daughter gets better and better fast. Thank you, my princess. God will bless you. Bless you. You really saved too. my life. It's okay. It's fine, Mama. <laughs> it's okay. Um, I will take my leave now. Thank you. My princess, the pride of Omoha Kingdom. You're highly welcome. Thank you, Mama. You're welcome, my princess. And thank you very much for everything. It's nothing, Zoba. The most important thing is that you're okay now. Um, I stopped by to check on you and to... Mama. Hey! Princess! <laughs> my princess! All this for us. Mama, it's okay. Hey! I'm not going to Mama, it's nothing. Just use it and buy a few hey. things for the house. The money is too big, my princess. No, Mama. Princess, thank hey. you. Thank, thank you, you no, my no, princess. No, no. Zoba, so, stop. Thank Come you, on, stop, 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 stop. I will, I will, I will get up hey. and go. Stop. My go princess. See money. Hey, my princess. Mama. God will bless you. Amen. Usebuluwa will always bless you. Amen, Mama. You're going in and you're coming in. God will guide you. Amen. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mama. Zoba Hi. Hey. Princess, thank you. You are an angel. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, it's okay. Zoba, please take care of yourself and your mother. Once in a while, I will always drop by to know how you people are doing. I will, be, I will forever be indebted to you. It's okay, we are friends now. You're my friend now. Hmm? All right, Mama, take care. Thank I will you. Take my leave from her. Thank you. All right. What if I take see, care? I see you off, Mama. Let me uh, see yes, yes. The medications are not working. They're not working. They're not. Can't you see it? It's like your medications are even killing my daughter. Huh? Your Highness, nothing will happen to her. She will not die. I'm seriously praying for her survival. Prayers. Your prayers are all of no effect. They're not working. Prayers are not working on my daughter. They're not. This girl is sleeping. She's sleeping through your fingers. And this is what I'm talking about prayers. Of course it's not effectual. Jizoba, you hypnotized my daughter and took her to the stream. If anything happens to my daughter, if anything happens to Kaima, I will skin you alive and I will also roast you whole and entire. Your Highness, let's give music a chance. Music is food to the soul. The princess, she loves good music.
Mama, the mama. Are you seriously eating? Huh? What changed? What happened? I thought yeah, you should be at the river by now. Mama, hmm? it is not written anywhere that I must come back from fishing before eating. <laughs> I tell you to eat though, to avoid also. Is it okay? Uh -huh, no. hmm. Is it not the same you that told me that a uh, man shall not live by bread alone? I'm not okay, cool. I can change it. Uh, you have changed it. <laughs> Hey, yeah, that's good. That, that's the fish. Right? Okay. Open in nature. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah, hey, what? what is this one for? In case customers come for his money. Oh. I'm not here, okay? Mm -hmm. By now, at least I'll rest from his embarrassment. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, my son. Chubu Oh. God bless you. Thank you. Ah. Uh -huh. so I'll go fishing later. Are you going to Well, yeah. and when you go, Mr. Meran, make sure you come with big one. Let's go to Mr. Meran. Hmm? Can you see how I can come out? Hmm? 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 Called you Joseph Adrian. Hey, hmm? But since you're not a man, eh? I have a foolish advice for you. As your dream interprets out, when you're one since you are now the dreamer. Hmm? Come up with that dream. Seal your lips. Hmm? Don't put your nose by. Why are they ginga? Eh? Dip your mouth. Keep it to yourself. Because the world has fear. What are you girls talking about? I only said what I saw. Would you? Don't ah. tell us. If you see anything in this house, don't tell us. Keep it to yourself. Girls, please, let's forget about that. When you open an idea, everybody will be home. Neka, you have your problem. Would you? On your run, run. As your dream is Peter, for the last time, still. Your lips. Why the ginga? The problem? Hmm? I just drop here. But I can't buy it. I want it. Man, see, I don't know. A bully see. It is a chair. I've said my own. You have your own problem. And me, at that, I have mine. So what am I saying? Every man with his own. Get yes, to. You need to leave us. I want to have a few words with my daughter. Go. Kaima, how? Oh, just look at you. See how helpless you are. Eh? You're not eating. No one even knows whether you're breathing or not. Eh? See what stubbornness has brought to your life. You were given just a few, a little, a little chance that you took a whole mile. Now see what stubbornness has done to you. Eh? What's wrong with you? Uh, excuse me, Your Highness. Please, uh, with due respect, my patients needs love and attention at this point in time, not interrogation. I'm sorry. Doctor. Your Highness. My daughter has love and care in abundance. What she doesn't have is direction. 
That's what she lacks. And that's why she is where she is. Of course, Your Highness, but at this point in time, she is under my care. And I can tell you for sure what exactly she needs. Love, care and attention. So just calm down. I'll tell you exactly what happened. Okay? Start talking. You and I went to the river for bath. And after that, when we were about leaving, you slide and hit your head on a sharp cliff of rock under the water. And immediately you became unconscious. That's exactly what brought us here. Are you okay? Under the water. Hmm. It's further away. I, I don't think so. I don't think so. Where is my phone? Your phone? Yes. My phone. Where is it? It should be at the palace. Or maybe at the river. River? Wait, let, let me try. Let me try the number. Let me try it for a minute. I'm not dealing off the phone though. No. I don't I don't think dealing off the phone is around, but I just, just saw it here. No, no, wait, 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 wait. Don't, don't hang up. Please, wait, just wait. Um, the owner of the phone is here. Ah. Where? At um Imperial Hospital. Please, I would appreciate if you can get the phone for me, please. I'm so sorry for, for the inconveniences. Please. Just help me and bring it. Hello? Hello? Imperial Hospital. Sorry, do you need water? Do you still have Fred's number? Um, let me check. Should be in my phone. Call him. This? It's me, Kaima. Ah, beautiful princess. What happened? I've been calling your line since yesterday severally, but you weren't picking your calls. I will explain all of that later. You need to know that I'm in the hospital. 
in the hospital. You went there to see someone? No. On admission, rather. What? Admitted? What happened? Hope it's not something serious. It's a head injury. But I guess I'm responding to treatment. Good, good. Uh, what's the name of the hospital? Um, it's um, Imperial... Imperial Hospital. Imperial Hospital. Ward 23. Ward 23. Imperial Hospital, Ward 23. All right, please hold on, okay? Let me change up. I'll, I'll meet you soon, all right? without telling me the word. Hello, please. Who is on the line? Mm -hmm. I beg. Which word? Let me now. Where you going, Nana? Na? Oh, okay, please. Just come to word 23. Word 23? Okay. Sims, he was close when I spoke with him. Who? Fred, of course. It's not Fred, it's the guy with your phone. The same guy that had to carry to the pallet the other day. I hope the princess is getting better. Who is this? The, the guy with the phone. Drop it and get out. What? Did get I out. did I do something wrong? It's okay. Did get out! out! That's my business. Did anyone wrong? I, I don't understand. Just 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 come down again. <coughs> Princess. Who is he? In your body. Okay. Get out. Get out! She needs an energy an, an, an drink. I'll be right back, okay? Hey! 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 Your daughter needs you now more than ever until she recovers. Alright, I I will send the maids with, uh, with our friend to lover. And all of them will spend the time in the hospital with her. Uh, Your Highness, uh, I, with due respect, this is not about dignity or protocol. You need to come over here and spend quality time with her to avoid any form of relapse. When is she going to be discharged? Uh, well, uh, until she is confirmed fit enough to be alone. Uh, but for now, I cannot assure you that the time is close. I, I, I cannot say for sure, Your, Your Highness. We're just taking it one day at a time. Well. I don't see how I can leave the palace and spend unspecified time at the hospital. I mean, this 
this is ridiculous. Uh, Your Highness, if you truly love your daughter, and I believe you do, then this is essential. Please. Mom. My son. That girl is so annoying. She doesn't respect me. She doesn't know her age grain because she's a princess. She gets angry so quick. To crown it all, she treats me like an animal. My son, you don't have to feel bad about how people treat you. Yes. All you need to do is to be challenged with it. Work harder, move forward. Challenge accepted because I've made up my mind to relocate to the city. Huh? City what? Yes. Can you go to the city and leave me here all alone to myself? You want me to die of boredom? Is that what you want from me? Mama, is it that you choose dying from extreme boredom or dying from extreme poverty? Okay, okay. If, if you get to the city now, who do you know? Where will you stay? How will you survive? Mama, when I get to that bridge, I will cross it. Kesti believe how someone who adore simplicity could be so tough on someone so humble and kind-hearted. How do you mean? What I mean is that you acted so wrongly on someone who saved your life. And was also there when another life-threatening issue is surfaced. Where is Fred? My prison, I'm talking about something important. I asked him of Fred. Anyways, he left immediately instead of fidgeting. Please. Can you call him for me? My phone battery is drained. At least let's be sure he's okay. My brother, please. Please, can you just stop fantasizing and face reality for once? Please. You know nothing about reality. And I will appreciate it if you do not meddle into what you know nothing about. I know love. I know exactly what love is all about. It's not selfish. It's not. I know what I'm talking about. Please, just stop. My classy Fred. My classy, handsome Fred is every woman's dream. And I love him a lot. My son, it is an honor for you to have served her. You may not receive reward from her directly, but definitely you will get your reward. That is karma for you. <coughs> Mama, these days people value money than honor. Yes, and that's why I want to go to the city and make money so that people can respect me. Respect. Is that all you want for yourself? Respect. That is all you care for? Mom, I need to make money, get married, raise a family, take care of you. All that demands money. So money is needed, no matter how you see it. Why are they still coming? The princess. Hello? Please come back to the office now. The princess needs to see you now more than ever. 
said I should come back to the hospital that the princess wants to see me now and then. Go. Yes. Maybe she wants to apologize to you. I'm not sure she's ready to apologize. Me, I'm not ready for any, for any, for any embarrassment. I'm not ready for any other embarrassment. I am not ready for any embarrassment again. Son, go. Go. You never can tell. Go. <clears throat> it is when you get there, you know why she's calling you. You don't have to give up on life. Yes. Life is not a bed of roses. Don't worry. If she embarrasses you, blame me on this. Put the blame on me. She even loved the shop. Which time was after all this wala now? What, what, what kind of problem is this? Why would I give somebody the clothes I want to use? Or what to know I pay? This one of private to look for people. Because I cannot give you my clothes this last week and you are turning me off. I will be calling you, your number will not be reachable. See this she's about anybody when you say this 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 best city. Anybody that knows she's about to better tell out. If I start now with full speed though, I'm not a, see. <laughs> see this girl. I need down. Where are you shouting? Don't tell me to calm down! Could not come anywhere, don't tell me to calm down. Tell me that I gave what is last week to help me fix. She's with now. See, if you know the anger in me, like you just you will you, you will step up more. Tell me that I gave what is last week. Can you do it? Calm down. Calm down, eh? Mm. She's over. I know she's over very well. She's not usually like this. She's like she, if you know her very well, you don't know me. You don't know me too well. Because if you know me, you would advise her to pray my God for me. She, I know she's over very well. <laughs> okay. She knows how to relate to her customers. Okay. And she's dedicated to her job. Okay, she should relate with me now. Oh yeah, hold on, let me call her. Eh? Huh. Make her the love. Mm. <laughs> she's going to even lock up. You don't think they will give me the gift. <laughs> this her number is not connecting. You see what I'm talking about? This one I've been conscious since last week. Now the event is fast approaching. Yes. She won't fall my hand at me. If I see her, I'm going to fall short her hand. Let me call the second number. Okay, okay, it's connecting. Yeah. Hello, Chizoba. Hello, it's Ononugu. to Princess Kaima, and I wish her quick recovery. Um, uh, Chizoba, there is a lady. There is a lady here with me. She wants to speak with you. Uh, Chizoba wants to speak with you. Calm down. Eh? Calm down and talk to her. Hello, Chizoba. It's me, Esther. See, Chizoba, I don't want any excuses by that weekend. Though. Don't fuck me up this time, I beg you. The event I want to use for is approaching very closely. I don't want this appointment though. This is about at the age of victory. I don't want time at all. Don't follow me to my bed. Problem. See, if, if, if you should see her after now, eh? Tell her not to, not to fuck me that day. This is the event I want to do and shape for my life. I can vouch for her. She's you, not like you. You vouch for her because what you affect will not affect some. You can vouch for her. I can vouch for no her. No problem. Eh? Why on, why on, nah? This girl, I'll be this woman. This one can divorce somebody. Princess Kaima, you need to reconsider your stand of Fred. I don't trust that guy. I don't trust him. If you have personal issues with him, trash it out and don't get me involved. <laughs> I am your bosom friend. That's why I'm open to you. Yes. I'm the only one to tell the truth. I just told you, trash out whatever it is you have with him. Leave me out of it. It's okay. My princess, it's time to take your drugs now. Leave it to me. You are yet to tell us because we all ate the same food. Yes, now. We all did. Guys, calm down. Calm down. Happiness is not always all about food. Huh. Oh. I'm not a foodie, personally. I'm not a foodie. 
But my concrete happiness is that I'm happy because my princess, the princess of my kingdom, is back to life. Is that not enough, enough to be happy? Well, 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 as a matter of fact, she came back to life because of the melodious tunes from my mouth. Or, haven't you noticed the king doesn't want to go to the hospital without me? It is because he believes so much with the melodious tunes and the powers from my mouth. <laughs> so, so, uh, uh, what are you feeling like now? Uh, uh, well, I am feeling like the most expensive and important guard in this palace now. Well, before I continue, let me give you a taste of the melodious tunes from my mouth. Watch this. Let me hear that your soothing mouth's magic melody. To the hospital. I asked you to call Fred and you dialed his number. But I already told you it was a mistake. I wanted to call Fred, as you said. But the young man picked. I didn't look at my phone before I died the last number. And besides, I was in a hurry to deliver the message. My data was not enough. Why not tell me you've got some feelings for that young man? What? Instead of making flimsy excuses for your mistake. This is unbelievable. My princess. A few minutes ago, I spoke about your despicable behavior towards that young man and you shoved it aside. Little did I know that you've lost your conscience as well. You know what? I'm leaving. It's over. It's over. It's over. In as much as you just spoke to me rudely, I will still apologize to you. But you have no such right whatsoever to speak to me in that manner and tone. That's simply the truth. I am your friend. I have to tell you the truth. Okay, fine. I, I am sorry. Is that okay? Go out there and apologize to him. To who? To him. <laughs> of course you and I know I will never do a thing like that. You see? Stubbornness and pride still rules you. Okay, fine. I, I will apologize to him. Help me call him. Mm -mm. I won't do that. You know why? Why not? So it will look as if I'm interested in that young man. Smash your pride. Go and talk to him yourself.
must, must, must you be rude because you're a princess? I saved your life. I brought back your food. What do I get in return? Insults upon insults. Huh? What's wrong with that your broken head? Because you're a princess. I don't blame you. You've been insulting me. What's my offense? I saved your life. I brought back your food. So why are you insulting me? Must you be rude because you're a princess? I'm not happy. Oh. Huh? I'm not a human being. Look at the way you've been talking to me. Get out. Go. Hey, nobody. Ah. So give me a princess. Me, I'm not happy. Oh. Do you realize you're talking to the princess of this land? So I should disappear because you're a princess. Are you the first princess? I saved your life. I did my best. I brought back your phone. But you keep insulting me. What's my offense? Were you not there? Are you not a special advisor? Can't you advise her? Come. I'm not coming. Madame, please come. In fact, I'm leaving. Natana, come. I'm not coming. Come. Natana! <laughs> Who are you? Your Highness, my name is Lotanna Chikadibia. Lotanna, are you a grandson to the late great medicine man Chikadibia? Yes, Your Highness, that's my grandfather. I see. Healing runs in your blood. Thank you, Your Highness. Please, I have to leave. I need to attend to my little business. Good day, Mama. Good day, my daughter. How are you? I'm fine, Ma. Okay. Um, Ma, I want to buy fish. Fish? Yes. Lutana is not around. I don't know why he's not here back. Okay. That means I'll go and come back. It's okay, my daughter. Please do, eh? Okay. Come back later. Maybe by then he'll be back. Okay, oh? then. All right, my dear. Wait. What is keeping him? Where is he? Where, where did he go to? I just hope that all is well with him. You are blessed from I want you all to imagine this scenario that has just played out. Imagine a scenario where your king, that's me, went to the hospital, took a bed as a babysitter. And that's a true scenario. I have to babysit my dear daughter here. All that is past now. But it brings me to what I really want to say. I wish to appoint a personal guard for my daughter here, the princess. Lutanda, 
the grandson of Chika Dibia, is hereby appointed the personal guard to the princess. And I have placed him on a salary scale far above what you all earn. This is with a view to letting you understand how important this appointment is. I hope there are no questions. No questions, you know. Father, please, can, can I talk to him private? <sighs> all right, boys and girls. You may all go back to your various duty posts. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you your majesty. Yes, Kevin. Yes, Father. Why would you take such a decision without my consent? Why? How can you appoint a personal guard for me without even telling me? Kaima, I do not need your permission to protect you. There are other young men in this community. Why him? Father, that guy stinks. He stinks badly. He saved you. He saved your life. I do not care, Father. Well, I do. I care. He resumes duty immediately. No, Father. <clears throat> Father, please. You walk. Yes. I don't really understand what's happening in this palace. What is it? Why would the king impose a personal guard on princess? Does it really matter what the princess feels about the king's decision? He is the king. <laughs> he is the king. And so his decision supersedes that of his daughter. That's right. His decision supersedes every of his subjects. That's how it works here. Mind your business. Back to your duty post. Lotana, what is it? Eh? This is no longer funny. Ever since you encountered with the princess, you please come back late. Eh? Mama, am I missing? Am I a baby? Mama, all is well now. I'm not saying I have a good news. Lutanda, I have a good news. What I'm trying to say is that Opochi Dinjo, days are bad. I want you to be careful out there. No problem, Mom. I ain't answer that for I will. Anyway, let me break this good news for you now. Uh, what is it? The king made me the special assistant to the princess. Who? <laughs> are you for real? I'm telling you, and guess what? What? My salary is double of what they are paying other guards. <laughs> this is really good news. <laughs> Simple work. All I have to do is just say like this. Okay? Yes, your yes, princess. Sir. Yes, yes sir. your majesty. <laughs> Moon and they give me money. What it comes. <laughs> Very simple work. And, this, and I, I believe that it's the princess that made this one to be possible. Yeah, I can't say, but the king called me and told me that from like, now, I'm the personal guard Chai. of the princess. Chai, you can't walk out. You can't walk out. What the This is good. I'm really happy. Indeed, it's a good news. It's a good news. Chai. Did you see that voice? Hey. I don't like you. I don't like you. Chai, this is really good news. Since the princess returned from service, it has been from one drama to the other. Or oh, haven't you guys noticed it? Nika, you like talking about things in a controversial way. It's not good. Hmm. Uju. Uh -huh. Uju. Uh -huh. Nika is not far from the truth this okay. time. Tell her. Tell me. What is wrong with that young man? Okay. Is he not looking fit as a man? Answer me now. 
My dear, it's such a wrong of paying someone who saved her life. Uh uh, it's not fair. Oh, do you know that she could have pretended, at least for the moment, and maybe later beg her father, the king, to reward the young man? But no. Anyways, that's true. Hmm. <laughs> and I heard the young man is coming back in the morning. <laughs> hmm. So let us watch out for the new drama series. <laughs> Please, hey. I have to sleep. I don't want her to come yelling at us in the morning while we are still on bed. Ah, uh, uh, she's not like that. Stop exaggerating things, yeah? please. She's not like that. Then how is she? Tell us. I think she's emotionally traumatized. Have you seen her man lately? Have you? Uh, I have to consider. Madam, please, eh? I want to sleep. Ngwa, shift. Catch you for? Shift. Shift. Look at this. Look at What is it? It just. Sorry, Margaret. It's all about your personal card. There's something. I don't like about your personal card. Speak. Um, that guy is too pompous. Now so the hand, the hand big, be like this. That small boy, that small rat. Huh? He's even too dirty that he can contaminate you with a virus or a disease. He's not got it. Yes, my princess. Hi. I can see you sure have some nerves to speak about what is not even your business in any manner or form. What business of yours is it with my personal guard? Learn to speak when you are asked to. Stay away from matters that does not concern you. Wait, are you not seeing what I'm saying? What are you seeing that I'm not saying? Okay. I think Lotana, the new guard, is playing his game properly in this palace. Hmm. Adako, how do you mean? Okay. Such guys that tries to be nice initially are dangerous. Hey, Adako. Chireo. Are you trying to say Lotanna is a gold digger? Exactly. Hey! That's what I'm saying. No, don't shout. Let's watch and see how everything plays out. I just hope my princess will be careful. My dear, she needs to do. Let's wait and watch how everything plays out. Mm -hmm. hmm? I'm telling you, because I know you. Don't say I told you anything. No, my Because this is your you. I know you very well. This is no. your mouth. This is your mouth. Ah, Mutana. Brother. Ah. I hope you're enjoying your new farm job. Yes, I'll enjoy it. Hmm. I like your attire, it's fine. Thank you. But it seems the princess is not comfortable with your presence. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. I believe with time she will be comfortable with me. Oh, really? 
You think so? I know so. Meanwhile, I want to take a walk. Talk to you later. It's okay. Thank you. Any latest information? Oh, no, not for now. Just that a new girl was employed at a personal guard that hindered me from meeting her. Who is the new guy? The guy that carried her home the day she had an accident. His name is Lutana Chikadi. He's a son of nobody. Don't worry, it's not a threat. Yeah, that reminds me. Is she still epileptic? No, no, not at all. Not at all. Certainly, I need some time to know, to be able to know what is actually going on. Ah, you have all the time, okay? Have all the time, but do a good job. Don't worry, by tomorrow I will send some tip as an incentive. Oh, thank you so much. I probably, like, you know my mind. So I can keep the board rolling. You know more things about her. It's nothing. Like I said earlier, do a good job and I'll keep rewarding you, right? Have a nice day. Thank you. Okay, <laughs> you are right, and he's also very brave. Eh, hey, Neka, I heard he's a fisherman. How come he sounds so eloquent? Being a fisherman does not mean one is that. It's an occupation. Choosing maybe by passion or lack of jobs in this society. Um, um, my name is Neka, one of the palace maidens. I'm a Daku, also a maiden in this palace. You guys already know my name, right? It was nice meeting you people. What were you doing there? I was pushing up. Were you not supposed to be by my side? My princess, I noticed you needed space. Yes, yeah, so I had to leave. You're such an irrational man, Lutanma. Henceforth, I don't want to ever see you talking to those girls. Your duty within the palace is within my confinement and can be stretched if need be. Are we clear on that? That's almost impossible, my princess. Maidens and guards work together to serve better. Our jobs are interwoven. So avoiding each other won't be easy. I do not care if your jobs are interwoven or not. You are in this palace for me and me alone. And that stands. I repeat, henceforth, don't ever say a word to those girls. All right. What kind of that is this? That's enough. Who does it better? Not me. I beg, let me show you my new style. Uh -uh. You know that one? I've not seen you dance before. Let me show you. Don't laugh for okay. Eh, 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 eh. <laughs> you don't like it? <laughs> I'm not cool. 
You must look out as your name. I got that. Go. Go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know. This is your dad's step, eh? Like it was my now. grandmother that taught me this and that's step in the village. Years back. What about this one? Don't say that thing. Turn something trendy. Look at yourself in the mirror. Something trendy now. You look like me. Thanks. Chinese people, that's how they do it. You guys are dancing. Anyway, I have a very important information for you girls. Radio <laughs> with our battery. What is the gossip this time? Is that how you see me? I'm going back with my fridge. Go where? Hey, I see. Come. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. In as much as I don't like when you talk too much. Tell us. Anyways, you girls just have to be careful with the princess's newly appointed guard. Why? <laughs> I overheard the princess calling him, telling him to be mindful of the maidens. I don't want you guys to get into trouble, so you just have to be very, very careful. Hey, is that jealousy or what? Eh? Now we say me could be fine girls. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, I've passed my information to you girls. And then we'll do something behind the house. Go and continue. Let me go. And continue. Go and continue. Okay. Bye bye. Thank you. Could it be true? She heard it. Or maybe she she just because I don't trust her. Please wait. Mm -hmm. It stands. Oh yeah, let's go. Keep your hand like this now. This is trending something. <laughs> He seemed not to be what I envisaged of him. Every new day unravels new and unique things about him. Is he really a fisherman? Or is there something fishy about him? His appearance is so down to earth. Yet when he speaks, his words carry his volume. I don't even have peace of mind because the thought of him already saturated my mind. knows if he's emotionally entangled with any of the maidens. Well, that would be tantamount to the replacement of such a maiden. I am the daughter of Igwe Mbagu I of Omoha Kingdom. 
I remain the pride and the princess of this land. I have never been fanatical about this. That's because I chose to be humble, blunt and civil. But that has given some of you the temerity, the impetus, the audacity to wander about the palace looking for what is not looking for you. Henceforth, I don't want to ever see any of you close to Lutana. He is my guard. My personal guard. My princess, none of us have anything to do with him. You. I saw you and Nega wobbling your mouth around him yesterday. What was the conversation all about? My princess, I swear to God, nothing. Nothing. I am certain both of you are aware of the level of punishment I meted out to Ineka yesterday. And why? I am asking you. Are you aware of the level of punishment I meted out to Ineka yesterday and why? Good. Henceforth, should I see any of you an inch close to Lutana, that will be tantamount to the same level of punishment I meted out to Neka. Are we clear on that? Yes, sir. Would go and call me Lutana? This woman, his luggage is not there too. Did you search for him around the palace? Yes, my princess. Lotanna Chica, your highness. Lotanna, you've been with me here. You've been with us here. We are used to you. Okay, and you're used to us. As a reward for your service, good service, I made you my daughter's personal guard. Eh? If there is any other thing you want me to do, you let me know, I will do it. Now, what do you want that will happen to my daughter? Do you want her to be exposed to undue danger? Or you want her to have a relapse? Your Highness, as a matter of fact, you have done beyond my expectation. Thank you once again. So why are you leaving? Why are you leaving? Or is there any other thing you want me to do for you? I'm prepared. Your Highness, the truth is that the princess doesn't love me. She doesn't even like me. She gets provoked at my actions and inactions, even when it's not necessary. I have tried my best to make her accept me the way I am, but to no avail. Hmm. I'm gonna go go more. Okay? I've done the best I can. To persuade you to stay on. Huh? I'm sorry, You're already a, a full grown man. If you get out there now, eh? and you didn't pay your tax, then tax people, hey, Jidegaka, I can you get Huh? Oh, if 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 uh, all my entreaties are falling on deaf ears, the governor. You may go. Thank you, Your Highness. I am sorry for my despicable behaviors towards you. Please forgive me, for I cannot feign ignorance of my actions 
towards you. I am begging you. My princess, sometimes we go sentimental on some issues. That doesn't mean we are evil. It simply shows we are human. No need crying over a spilled milk. My mind is made. I have to go. I'm sorry. It's an ambulance. Lutanna. I know I have behaved more like a beast before you. Please forgive me. You owe me no apology. And I hold no grudge against you. Follow your heart, princess. Please. I. Okay, I swear. I swear by my late mother that I will never treat you wrongly ever again. Don't go. I have acknowledged my mistakes and I promise never to repeat them. At least for the sake of my father. Stay, please, I am begging you. Jimmy Hyde. You better see something do your head. You dey crazy. Eh? You look me finished, they make her wear your shoe. Something they worry you. Eh? You see this guy only mad. Am I the one you're talking to or who are you referring to? See, eh? let's say these overgrown beers don't they, don't they worry you for brain. By the way, where you been go? Hmm? You're still asking me where have I been? Are you a monetary spirit? Are you a monetary spirit in the palace? That you are asking me where I'm coming from? Or where? Or are you a police inspector? Yeah? Now tell me, tell me. How is it your business where I'm going to or what I do? Am I answerable to you? Am I answerable to you? See, Chihuahua. It be like say no know your place for this palace. You don't know that you were employed as a palace guard. Eh? A palace guard will always be on alert, looking, watching the gates to see if anything will come into the palace. Then you shade it. Not going round looking for something to gossip with this your overgrown beers. Eh? What is wrong with you? Police inspector, I'm now the defender of the palace. Eh? Iwako, Iwako, warn this your guy. Warn your guy seriously before I will vent my anger on him. Eh? This is my last warning. This is my last warning. Why should I warn him? Answer me. Why should I warn him? If you be at your duty post, no one will poke a finger at you. Now I see. Bets of the feather. So, I see, I foresee conspiracy. <laughs> so, if you are conspiring against me, because I'm prospering in the kingdom. <laughs> Bro, anyway. I just want to take it. O pelikli gana muk wose. Adari edu. O pelikli, my last one. No amount of conspiracy. See what they conspired against. Wow, what is he doing now? Chihuahua. Chihuahua. Mr. Conspiracy. Chihuahua. I didn't look like Chihuahua. I swear, I don't look like Chihuahua. Jobless man. Mr. Gossip. More sense you want me. Everyone know me as a calm, 
polite and kind princess. What? My princess, I believe you, but at the same time, I'm still in doubt. Of course. What you did is a sign of doubt. Yes, because it's hard to believe. I think you misunderstood me. I'm a very calm person. Well, life is funny. Yesterday I was treated like you're an arch enemy. And here you are treating me like a best friend today. Life is indeed funny. That is life for you. Anyways, there is something about you that I have been struggling to solve like a puzzle. So I wouldn't mind if you can help me. What is that? Who really are you, Lutana? I am Lotanna Chikadibia, the son of Undoka, a fisherman that lives with his mom. I already know all of that about you. But I want to know more. So please, who are you? My princess, I already told you who I am. Except you want me to start lying. No. Just the truth. The truth about you. The truth about your identity. The truth about the man that is seated in my presence. Please. Who are you? Why do you keep busy in your call? Because it's no one important. I would want you to do me a favor today. Would you mind? Okay. I'm all ears. Stand at my door. Do not let anyone in, irrespective of who he or she is. Your wish is my command, my princess. But are you expecting anyone? <laughs> well, not really. But someone might come. Your wish is my command, my princess.
What's wrong with your hand? You hard to say, it's a serious matter. The partner guards don't think that Kaima did this to me. Really? Yes, Your Highness. Yes, he's doing his job. What? That's unbelievable. Are you supporting him over me? I'm off his Fred. The end You left my daughter when she needed you. Now you're back, you want to pick it up from where you left. Johannes, I'm, I'm so sorry about that. I've been busy. Schedules about schedules, appointments after appointments. I'm sorry, I promised to make it up to her. I will. So, did, did you see her? No, no, I did not see her. I was about meeting her and I was interrupted by the personal guard. And before I did this to me, I wasn't able to see her. Did you call through before coming? Yes. Yes, Your Highness, I called. Seven. And she kept busy in my calls. So. I will. I will speak with her. I'm sure she's still uh, smarting from uh, what you did to her. Thank you, Your Highness, sir. I'll take my leave. I'm so disappointed. Very, very disappointed. How can you be my eye in this palace and allow someone else to take the princess away from me? Oh, huh? I'm, I'm only a guy. But what do you expect? What do I expect you to do? I expect you to come and defend me. What are the two of a girl starting to bang my head? Huh? What are you doing? All you are going in is extorting money from me. That's all you are going in. What about the money I've been what about the money I've been giving to you and you stand there without defending me? Yes, my princess. I need you to do me a little favor. What is it? Since I started walking here, I've been missing my mother. She's the only person I have in this world. Permit me to pay her a visit. Of course you know I can't stop you. At the end of the day, you were already leaving when I begged you to stay. So you have my permission. Thank you very much, my princess. I beg to take my leave. I also need you to do me a favor. I would love to go with you to see your mom. That's if you don't mind. Don't bother yourself, my princess. Are you doubting I won't return? Not at all. I trust you a lot, Luther. But I honestly want to meet with a woman that better this courageous man standing before me. As it pleases, my princess. I beg to take my leave.
You are welcome. Thank you. Mama. How are you? I'm fine. Oh, greetings, Mama. So, you came with the princess? Yes, she insisted that she must come with me to see you. Please, let's sit. I, I don't need to keep the princess standing. Mama, how have you been? I'm good. You're welcome, my princess. You look beautiful. She said I'm beautiful. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's an honor for the princess of our land to step her foot into my compound. <laughs> I, I, I have so many things here. I, I, I can give you. It, it, like, uh, opa. Yes, I, I can give you opa. 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 Whichever you want, you want. I can be first about it. Mama, it's okay. Don't bother yourself about me. No, 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 no. That's no stress for me. Oh. It's no stress. Mama, it's okay. Eh. I was actually going to see a friend for an important meeting. So I told Lotanna. In fact, I insisted that I follow him to see you and know how you're doing. Thank you. Thank you. I'm honored, my princess. Thank you so much. You're Thank you. Mama. Uh, son. I was supposed to drop the princess somewhere before we decided to check on you. Please, permit us to leave. I'm still on duty. Yes, hey. Mama. Um, we hurriedly came to see you. I wanted to go and see one of my friends out there for an important meeting, but we decided to come see you first. Hey. Uh, okay, no, no problem. But my princess, when next you come, uh, uh, try to stay long so that I can, you know, prepare something for you I to eat. I will, Mama. I will. Um, let me come. Let me get something from the car. Is it okay? I just want to tell you that you actually gave birth to a great son. A hard working one of that. So it's for you. Thank you. Sir. Hey, all this for me, for me alone. Yes, Mama. Hey, God bless you. Oh, God bless you. You see. God bless you. you Thank see. you so much. May the Lord prosper you. You see. May the Lord continue to bless you. You see. Hey, thank you so much. Thank you, hey. Mama. Like. Oh, who invited you? And what made you think that we are both discussing about the princess? Who else called the both of you the last time? We were talking to Lotana. Who else? I said it's Ekurumiyoku. Now I know we have a settle among us. <laughs> yes! You have your mouth, so you can say whatever you want to say with it. Anyway, Princess Taima just called, and she said the both of you should fix up Lotana's room immediately. In their spirit. Hey! This is what I'm saying to you, not part of the truth. I told you that this girl, let me ask you. Are we all not working for Lotana? Why must it be the two of us mm. that will arrange his room? Nim, if you ask me, who will I ask? The way both of them are talking shows that there is something intimate beyond just being a personal guy. Mm. 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 What is this? Please, please, oh, please oh, don't put me in trouble. Ah, ah. Hmm. See, at this point, you just call me up and finish what we're doing. I'm going to do what the princess asked us to do. You know how she behaves. If she calms down and gets on doing another thing, hey, hey, she's firing like an untrained dog. Hmm? Please, you know the war has ears. Be for what? Please don't come here. Why do? Wait. Imagine Uju. Uju of yesterday. Leave Uju for me. Leave Uju for me. In this palace. Leave her. Leave her. Let's continue. Finally, the rejected stone has become the chief corner stone. Jesus, I don't understand what you're saying. I told you my father made you my personal guard, and that's all. 
He goes wherever you go to, right? He stays wherever you are. Remember, he's still a young, vibrant guy. So, before you know it, emotions will begin to grow. Then the next thing I'll hear is, um, Zaba, Zaba, I think he's such a cute and responsible guy. I know they will. I, 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 I'm trying to understand the reason I am here to see you. And you're talking about that young man. Zoba, I'm suspecting you. Why tell me you've got your eyes on that man? Wait, wait, my princess. Are you, are you kidding me right now? No, I'm not. You know I have no such time. You've been talking about him all day and all. I, I don't understand. I was only sympathizing with the guy. How you treated him at the hospital. It was, it was so appalling. I don't go there. I'll be your friend now. Let me go so tell you the we truth. are over that issue now. We are over it, aren't we? Yeah, she said, I am not here for that anyways, but partly for it. You see, Zoba is not totally wrong. <laughs> Zoba, will you come let me whisper, Joe? Can't you say, nobody's here, okay, don't oh. worry, don't worry. What is it? Bring it out. Zoba, don't say anything. Don't, don't just say, and don't say anything. Don't laugh. So if I don't say anything, I'm... But, sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Which kind of face be this one? Chihuahua. Why are you carrying your face like a rotten mango? What happened? Wait, make her ask for What is that guy feeling like? That, that guy that's feeling like King Kong and Superman. What is he feeling like? Who are you talking about? Wait, oh, are you trying to tell me that you're not, you don't know what is going on? Are both of you not in this palace? From my observation, that guy is a snitch. A total snitch. His plan in this palace is to walk us out and become Igwe's chief guard. And it will not work. I, Chihuahua, is here to declare that no Jupiter will make it work. In case, you should go and tell him that I said so. Oh, oh. <laughs> Do you know that this guy is a stupid person? He's talking about Lutana. I saw. <laughs> so jealous you. The, wait, wait, wait. Who else should we be talking about? Lutana. Is that why you are wearing the face of a sour grape? <laughs> <laughs> see, see, human beings, I thought that we are my friends. Oh, you poor two faced. I thought that we are we are together. I don't know that you poor are... you have sold your soul to the devil. <laughs> huh? Look, let me tell you. If you want to be my friend, stop snitching around and mind your business. I'm not a psychophant like you. You're speaking English. Stop snitching around and mind your business. You're a psychophant. In fact, you are a nikompu. Huh? You are a psychophant and a nikompu. Chihuahua. Chihuahua, you are just a dog. Do not dare a lion. Else you will be devoured. Look at the lion. Dead lion. A dog is better than a dead lion. A dog is bigger than a dead lion. I've warned you. Jobless human beings. Come. Stop pouring me sal saliva. So go to where you were going to. Chihuahua is not like Get people. out. You get in. Stupid. Stupid idiot. Get out. Look at the shape of your head. Best of the same for them. This guy is a jealous human being. Very stupid. See where your mind go. Lutala. Hey! Chihuahua, are you deaf? How many times do you want me to call you before you answer? I'm sorry, my princess, I didn't hear you earlier. I thought I asked you to wash my car. Your car? 
I thought you told Lieutenant to wash your car. Are you crazy? No matter. Are you mad? Which of them have you become? I asked, are you crazy? No, my princess. But my princess, I was there. Shut up. My leniency and simplicity has contributed to the exhibition of your extreme madness in this palace. Continue until I become my officials. I'm sorry, my princess. Five minutes to clean up the car. Chihuahua, just, just, just clean the car, okay? Wash what? What's that guy doing in his palace? Just, just, just do it. You have to do it, okay? Fisherman, a common fisherman dragged my own fiance with me. If I told you about it, if I complained to you, I complained to you about this whole thing, but instead you gave me a deaf ear and you promised me that you're gonna talk with the princess. I've not heard from you, I'm not heard from the princess. Uh, Quiet. What's wrong with you? Listen, I am the Igwe of this community. I rule everyone. You, your father who is the senator, everyone. Listen, whenever you speak to me, speak with reverence, not arrogance. Nonsense. Uh, Igwe, Igwe. God, how, how can a common fisherman Drag my own fiancé with me. How? This is the height of disrespect. The height of disrespect from the king and the princess. to give me a massage. I've been having body pains for a long time now. Your wish is my command, my princess. Oh. 
Oh shit. Lutina go down. Oh shit. Oh. I'm sorry, my princess. I can't go beyond this point. But you accepted to do the job. I've done my part. I beg to take my leave. Lutana. My princess. This is actually what I want you to do with me. Make me feel like a woman. With all due respect, my princess, this is not part of my job. Shh. I decide what your job in this palace is. Stop. Hey. I need to leave this place now. Please. play gradually what will he be thinking of me now I can no longer pride myself before him sent for me, my princess. May I have some words with you? If it is about what happened yesterday, it has gone with yesterday. How do you know about that? Your countenance told me. Lutana. Hope I will not be blackmailed. I have no proof to do that. Please, will you forgive me? I know I have done worst thing ever. My prince says you have done nothing worse than what people do in secret. Like I said, let bygone be bygone. Thank you very much. This means a lot to me. When will you be going to see your mom? Why do you ask my princess? I'm interested. I would love to see her as well. You are welcome anytime, any day, my princess. Thank you. Thanks for your kind gesture. Jonathan, I appreciate it. It's nothing. I beg to take my leave. You sent for me, Father. Yes, I did. Kaima. Lotana has told me everything. What I want from you now is to tell me exactly the despicable behavior and how it happened. 
So this guy only deceived me in believing that he got my back. Humans can't be trusted. Now how do I present it to my father? Kaima? Father. Father, I'm genuinely sorry. I... I can't even face you at all. I am sorry for my despicable behavior. I honestly do not know what came over me. Now you blame the devil for your heinous act. You also know that you are wrong, totally wrong, for insulting Fred. Did you actually call me here to sit and discuss Fred? Okay. Did you, did you invite me to discuss the issues that I had with Fred or what, Father? Tell me the issues you had. Other issues, any issues you had. Tell me about them. No issues, Father. Not with anyone. No issues? No issues. Can you go ahead and tell me about your clash with Fred? Because the young man is, I mean, he has inundated my phone with calls. Fred does not have an iota of feelings for me. Fred does not love me, Dad. He only loves the throne. How else do I make you understand that? He's so much engrossed with his quest for power and wealth that he can compromise even his own destiny. That guy does not respect nor love me. <laughs> Kaima, I do not understand what you're talking about. I can tell you that I really know what you're talking about. What I know is that Fred is a perfect gentleman. He comes from a family that's well bred. He comes from, I mean, in fact, he is the son of a respected senator of the Federal Republic. Okay? And I tell you, Kaima, you and Fred make a perfect match. Know that Princess Kaima and Fred, the son of the senator, can never and will never be compatible. Moreover, that those are not my criteria for picking a lifetime partner. That is a lifetime partner, Dad. Kaima, can you tell me? Can you talk about what those criteria, the criteria you fancy, tell me about them? Before I start thinking that, that your accident actually is having an effect on you. It's so hurtful, you know. It's rather too painful that my father constantly not minding how I feel 
reminds me of my past. Of all the past, the accident, the very accident that almost took my life. <sighs> but it's okay. One thing you must know, Dad. I, Chikaima, will not sit and let you manipulate me into making a choice that will destroy my entire life. I will not let you do that to me using my past. Having said that, give me some time. Let me think about it. Troubled. Uh, what could be the problem? It is beyond your comprehension, Chihuahua. My princess, there's nothing I cannot handle. And that's the reason why we're here. No matter what the situation is, I can handle it. I can put it at ease. That's why we're here, Chihuahua. Do you realize that the princess has a personal bodyguard and it is his personal responsibility to care for the princess? You're speaking English. Personal what? So we that are here that are guards, are we gardeners? Personal bodyguard. So what is it that that, uh, that guy can handle that I cannot handle? Huh? We are here to protect the king and also protect her. You're speaking English, personal bodyguard. Get lost. You disappear. No! Get lost! Do you want to fight me? Do you want to fight me? My princess. Please, I beg of you. Do not succumb to the pressure from the king. Follow your heart, please. Like I said before, you people may never understand. My father is the king of this kingdom. He says what he means and mean what he says. Hence the reason he prides himself as the Ekuweme one of Omoha kingdom. I hope that makes more sense to you now. Yes, it does, my princess. But you can also make him to believe in what your heart wants. My father is a very stubborn king. He will never listen to what my heart wants. He will never want what I want and me following my heart will automatically make me an arch enemy to him. If I follow my father's biddings, I may never find happiness for the rest of my life. So you see, it's complicated. Yes, it is. Yes, it is, my princess. But you can give it a trial this time. You can. Oh, see, I may be an ordinary palace guard, but my intelligence, it speaks volume. Who 
who is this that's doing this? Come on, spill it, spit it out. Let me hear you. That which troubles me is in your jurisdiction to end. My jurisdiction lies within my power. No. I'm more worried about who is doing this to you. Spirit or human, who is that person? I know what to do to the person. I will tear everything around you. Disturbing you, I will tear it down. What is happening? Who is the person? I will deal with the person. Come on. It's your father. Me? How? <clears throat> father. I just want to beg you to listen to me. Look, I'm here. You know I'm your good daughter. I've always been. You are proud of me and I know. But this one thing that I'm asking of you, I beg of you to grant. Father, you're forcing me to love Fred. And I don't see myself ever loving him again. for the sake of my late mother to so please allow me to make this lifetime decision for myself. Father, don't allow me to make mistakes. Mistakes that would destroy me. Mistakes that would destroy your only child. The only one your late wife. Perfect for you. Kaima. Kaima. The theatrix. The theatrix are too much. Now, but you see, sit down first. Sit, 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 sit. We are going to discuss this issue. Come on. Nothing I can do about this now. King Mbago. The icon of his time. The king of kings. one whose integrity matters to him most, even more than the life of his only child. What? King Mbago. The father of my youth. One that raised me. The one that has and is you squeezing me so hard to life. 
we talked about this hotel. And I ask you, Father, I ask you, a king whose integrity reigns amongst all the socialists, that if I ever died as infant, would Fred have remained single for the rest of his life just because I am not there to wife him? See, 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 Kaima. This is different. Mm. This is different. I'm telling you about a family knot that was tied. It's deep. Something that can never be undone. I'm not even sure that any human can undo it. So, I mean, you just have to learn to love him. That will be over my dead body. That I, Princess Kaima, the daughter of King Uba, the one of this kingdom, will learn to love Fred. I can never even learn to love that monster. My soul, my heart, my body belong to someone else. And you must have to accept. Hmm. I think there is something more between Princess Kaima and Lotana at the Sinagad. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Hi! Would you? Hmm? What do you mean? Hmm. As I was doing my personal chores, so I overheard the king scolding the princess for treating Fred badly. And my instinct is telling me that she's connected to Lotana. Would you? Hmm? Would you? Uju, hmm? how many times did I call you? Three Mind times. what you say with this your mouth. Be careful of what comes out from this your mouth. Wait, <laughs> see, as the king was even scolding her, she walked out of the king, which is a mark of this honor. She even said in her words, my heart belongs to somebody else. <sighs> you may be right too. You may be right. I am right this time around. I saw her the other day professing love to Lotana at the entrance of her room. Eh? Eh? Who? Lotana. Ordinary Lotana. It's no longer ordinary again, you. <laughs> no longer ordinary. He. And what was his response? <laughs> he was happy. Who won't be happy to be loved by the pride of Umunoha? Even you two, you'll be happy. Hey. hey! You see? You see what I told you the other day? Mm. I told you that guy, Lutana, is playing his game perfectly well. Bam. But you didn't believe me. You're seeing it now. I believe you. Hmm. I believe you now. After you said all those things, I started doing my research. Ah! And I saw everything myself. I, I don't even know where you belong. Mm -hmm. Eh? I am everywhere like MTN. Everywhere you go. <laughs> Hey! Hey! Lutana, don't say I told you anything. No. I did not say anything, please. Yeah? Well, that shall never end. Honorable Senator of the Federal Republic. My king. Good afternoon. Oh, thank you. Thank you, my Senator. So, how is the house? Yes, the house is in order. I'm calling to let you know there's a vacancy in the Ministry of Petroleum Resources. Well, my king, I'll be giving two slots, and I'm apportioning one slot to your daughter, my wife to be, Princess Kaima. That's why I call you Senator of the People, Senator of the Federal Republic. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. So, uh, 
Uh, what are the prerequisites? <laughs> My king, there is no prerequisite. I am the prerequisite, and uh, there's no CV, there's no certificate. But if she has any of these, you can present them for parenting's sake. That's all. This is Nigeria. <laughs> this can only come from a senator. A senator. I thank you very much. Oh, Chubu Kaima will be delighted to hear this. Thank you very much. Well, my king, you are welcome. Okay. All right. Bye. Ah. You are guys here. Yeah. I'm very My princess, you are supposed to order him, not begging him. Most times you have to apply diplomas in order to win a war. You must not be confrontational. Well, I am not here for you to lecture on morality. I'm here so we can settle our differences. The difference here is that you, Mr. Fred, is dogged by what you want. That's what you need. See? Princess, um, without mixing words, you know that I love you so much. And I want you to marry me. I'm so sorry I wasn't there when you needed me the most. I'm sorry about that, but please. Give me this one last chance and I will never mess it up. The truth is that the vacuum has been filled by another when you left. And you don't expect me to walk him out of my life just like that, do you? Uh, he, he's a nobody, right? He doesn't count. I, I, I love you so much, you know how far we've gone. I'm the son of a, a, a serving senator. You don't need to know about Princess. Princess! What an insolence. This is the height of disrespect. Me, Fred, the son of Senator Wachuku. Ah. Igwe must hear this. Nah. Igwe must hear this. Igwe! Huh. Agaba, do you know there's a lot of things happening in this palace that we cannot remove our eyes from them? Hmm? Well, what are you talking about? We are about to witness the biggest wrestling festival of love in this palace. Ah, seriously? Yes, now. Between who? Between Fred and Lotana. Yeah. Fred and Lutan. Mm -hmm. What happened? What was the problem? Now listen. The other day, mm -hmm. the princess and Lutana were together. Okay. And all of a sudden, Fred walked in and told Lutana to leave. For what? Uh -huh. Why will he tell Lutana to leave? Is it because Lutana is just an ordinary guard like us? You see the problem? That's the problem we're facing here. Now, trust Lutana now. The Odogu with us. Mm -hmm. The Buruburu one. He refused to leave. Good. He stood his ground and he said no, until the princess decided to beg him to leave. I trust Lotana. Lotana is not, is not a coward like Chihuahua. No, no, no. He's a very brave man. That's how we roll. But uh, it's okay. you know the way we're doing this thing? Yeah. yeah. So yeah. nobody should come and there. Uh, <laughs> Why not? Each time you come, I know there is trouble. Yes, there is trouble. The whole of trouble, Your Highness. I was with uh, Princess Kaima. I knelt down, I begged her. I wailed. But instead, she walked out of me. She told me someone else won her heart. I, I didn't understand this, Your Highness. 
That's not true. She was only pulling your nails. From all indication, Your Highness, she's very, very serious. She told me herself, someone has won her heart. Yes. That's a big fallacy. I know my daughter. No one comes here to see her. No one. Well, I'm sorry I have to shout it, but Fred, no one comes here to see my daughter. All right, Your Highness, uh, if you're insinuating that I am accusing her wrongly, then why don't you send for her? At least for fair hearing. I'll go up and bring her down myself. Fair enough? Yes, yes, yes. Fair enough. Fair enough. Excuse me. Anything that blocks your way, rush it. Did I communicate? Yes, Your Highness. That boy must pay. Pay in full.
looked for? What has he done? Run! Run! What has he done? What has he done? What has he done? What has he done? What has he done today? Where did I have I him? Eh? Tell your son that he can run, but he can never hide from me. Okay. Because I must surely get him. What has he done? Bria, shut up! Shut your mouth! Shut your mouth! We're coming back for you! Where is Lotanna? Your Highness, he is nowhere to be found. And you're looking me in the face to tell me that. Instead of telling me what you're doing to get him. Igwe, his mother paved way for his escape. What? Yes, and I punched her. She fainted. Oh! So, you punched her on the face and she fainted. I see. See your face. You should be ashamed of yourself. You punched an old woman old enough to be your mother. And you're gloating. Where is your intelligence? Igwe, I'm sorry. But you gave an instruction. You said we should crush whatever that come on our way in getting Lotana. And I acted based on your instruction, Igwe. Okay. So you're indicting me. Is that so? No, Your Highness. Now before I open my eyes, all of you have disappeared from my sight. Walk. I want Lotanna. Move it! Why you're calling me like this? Hope all is well. All is not well, Zoba. What is it? Is Fred still disturbing you? That is very little compared to what I am about to face. Zoba, I am in total mess right now. In very big trouble. I don't know what to do. Please, will you advise me? Advise you on what? You have, I haven't said anything yet. What am I advising you on? I was caught on bed with him. With who? Lotanna. What? That's so stupid of you. How could you be that careless not to know that even if you must do something with that guy, you should be outside the palace. Now, now you've soaked yourself in a mess. Zopa, please will you stop? I did not call you for you to apportion beams. The deed has been done. Listen. Tell me what to do. I know you can actually do something. I am confused. My princess, how, do, how, how can I help you when the loophole is so, is, so, is, is so obvious? How can I help you? Soba, will you stop? Think of something. That's the reason I called, not for you to blame me. Ha, ah, Princess Kama, this, you see this one, I know do and wear. I know go lie you. You know do and wear. You know what? First thing tomorrow morning, I'll come to the palace and see you. For, for now, I want to go and pick up a uh, material from a client like that. And all these big men, uh, wife. Let me just go and pick it up. Tomorrow morning, I will come and see you, okay? I cannot come now. I will come later. Tomorrow morning, first thing tomorrow, I will come and see you, okay? Okay, thank you. Thank you. You have to meet him at his quiet time and apologize. And while you do that, ensure that your gesture portrays remorse. That's all. So, uh, yes. It's going to be difficult. 
cannot stand his presence. The sight of him scares the hell out of me. The shame of what I did has covered me up. Then you cover it yourself. How, Zoba? How? He's still your father. He's your father. Just go to him and apologize. Okay? His reaction will then tell if there is any need for any other decision. Just try. Just try. Okay? Zoba, you know my father. Fine, I will try. Good. I have to kick her in now. Why so early? I want to go to the shop. I guess I'm not around. I have some things to fix for a customer. Please. Okay, no problems. I'll call you if there is need to. Prodigals. Do you remember the prodigal? Do you remember the parable of the prodigal son in the Bible? He was forgiven, Father, and even given a better opportunity. Not an actual event, not a real occurrence. Kaima. Kaima, you disgraced me time and time again. Kaima, what's the matter with you? Kaima, you did the unimaginable. You rejected Fred. I know that you were having an affair with that, that nonentity, that, that gold digger. Oh. Father, Luther and I 
nothing good to take her. You, you need to know him beyond being a fisherman and the palace godfather. There is something about him. Something about him that is special and unique. And you need to know that, Father. Oh, you listen to me. Kaima, you must reconcile with Fred. See, I'm not going to tell him what happened. Right? No one even needs to know what happened except to tell the person. You need to know that I have no issues with Fred. But I cannot see myself spend the rest of my life with him. The sight of that man disgusts and irritates me. Do not push me into this, Father. I am begging you. Utterly bewitched by that gold digger. No, Tanya did not bewitch me, Father. Something inside of him did. Father, please forgive you, Tanya. Allow him back to the palace. What? Thought you were going to come here, sounding remorseful. Now you are asking something that's impossible. No, father. There is nothing impossible for the king, for my father. You can make it possible if you want to, father. Please. Leave my presence. Get out of my sight! Organism, what is it? Can you just tell me what happened? Can you not tell me what happened? Mom, please. I need to be left alone. I need space to put myself together. Son, I am your mother. You are my son. Whatever it is, feel free to tell me. Whatever secret it is, Feel free to tell me. I will sell it. I will tell you when the time is right. For now, I need space, please. Let me be. Okay. Did you fight? Did you argue with anyone? Why are you here? Why did you come back? Mama, Ebo Jelumba, Anatago. Simple. Don't worry, when the time is right, I will tell you. For now, please, just leave me. One, Lutana. 
ran out of the palace like a mantle. So all is well. Oh, if you ask me, who will I ask? I even intend asking you. I remember um, trying to ask Iwoko and Agada, but they wouldn't give me listening ears. So you tell us. Maybe you need that of information. So tell us. Hmm. Also, many to have information. So, the king asked that Lutana should be checked away. Um, but uh, I asked Iwoko. You see, he doesn't have uh, what I got the clue of what is going on. Look at that. Eh? It is so strange. Only the Princess Daima and Igwe knows about it. Oh, my God, you. It's somehow. It's true. It's true. You're right. No wonder. Igwe cannot do anything without. Listening to Princess Kaima. The way he will listen to Princess Kaima this time around is actually becoming so strange that even he will have to tell him walk, not allow Princess Kaima to leave the palace without a guard or a maid. Hmm. Please come in. I want to tell you something. This one you are whispering and murmuring. Hope what am I safe? Eh, as you can see, we are walking. I'm sweeping. Eh? So I need to go back to my sleeping. I need to be fast. Oh, you're sweeping and walking. Okay. If I see you up there, make one. Can I not try to share for me? Go back to your duty. Make one share update. Eh, go. <laughs> go. Oh, God, go now. Who's up, please? I'm not going to. You want to know everything? Yes. Yeah. Fred! Fred, sit down. Thank you, Highness. Sit down. Ah, Your Highness, you called me on the phone and you sounded so urgent. I hope all is well. Hey, Fred. <laughs> all is well. Don't worry, Fred. Man. It's, uh, um, the proposal you dropped with us concerning the ultra modern modern market. Huh? My cabinet and I we have George George, we have read, we have gone through thoroughly. We've discussed and we think that yes, you can now start. Igwe, I'm, I'm sorry. I had a change of mind. I'm no longer interested. What? No, no. That's not fair. I'm sure you don't want to ridic put me to ridicule before, before the community and, and my chiefs. Eh? It's not my fault, Igwe. It's not my fault. So, it's my fault? No, Igwe. I never said so. Igwe, uh, I was emotionally traumatized. And the cause was because of Princess Kaima. I told my father to give your daughter a slot out of the two slots from the Ministry of Petroleum. What did I get in return? Rejection. I'm sorry, Your Highness, I had to change my mind. Fred. Fred. And where do Louis we balonwa? Anger. Anger does not fetch us anything meaningful. 
Hmm? Yes. See, see, uh, 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 a, a chicken, a uh, hen, gathers its food from left, from right, and all around heaps food. And then, in a fit of an anger, begins to scatter. Fiam, 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 fiam. Fred. Will it go hungry? Yeah, come on. I know where your anger is coming from. I know where your grief is coming from. Fred, Kaima is my daughter, and I know how to handle her. I assure you that. <laughs> Ujumwa, my princess, you are the most trusted maiden in this palace. Can I trust you? Yes, my princess. Have you ever loved? Have you ever loved someone so much before? Like, have you fell in love before? Yeah. No, 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 my friend. I am asking something. Have would you want to listen? Okay. Have you ever loved someone so much? that you cannot do without him. Have you ever loved someone so much that... Majesty. Why have you chosen to disgrace me? I don't understand. How do you mean, Father? Kaima, what has Fred not done for you? What? Listen, Kaima. Fred will take very good care of you if he marries you. The question should be, what has Fred not done for me? Um, if Fred marries me, father, he will not and cannot take good care of me. The accident error confirmed it. Asege. Okutu ba asege. At the insistence of Fred, his father gave the appointment with the Federal Ministry of Petroleum Resources. Fred himself has come into this community now to give us an ultra-modern market. What is it that he hasn't done for us? We're all beneficiaries of that. And for that, my father is selling me off for the good of the community. From inception, Father, my life, my entire existence have been tied to either tradition or affluence. But that must stop. 
henceforth. Whatever it is that does not matter to me will not ruin my happiness. Grandma, don't be ridiculous. Come on, Father. Come on. I am hell-bent on my decision. Now listen. Fred will marry you. I will marry Lutana. Pregnant for who? Lutana. Father of my youth. A king that raised me even without my mother. The toughest of them all as a king. I am breaking you. I am begging you to accept Lutanda. Accept him as your own. And give us your blessings and support. That is not too much of me to ask. <laughs> see, see. You must get rid of that thing there. Get rid of it. Get rid of it immediately. Take it off. I bought it now. It's my child. Your grandchild, father. A child of woman. You only woman I've ever loved. That is who you refer to as a thing. It is not fair, father. You will not tell me. 
what is fair, whether it is fair, whether it's not fair to call what you have there as a thing because that's what it is. So I bought it. Take it off. That will be over my dead body. That I have bought the child of the only man who gave me life when the doctors failed. The one God used to save me. I will never do that. But if you do not want to accept this child, this child that I am carrying as your grandchild, if you do not want to accept Lotana as my husband to be, I will have no option than to leave this palace in search of him. All right. All right. If that's how you want it, then you listen, you listen, and you listen, and you listen. If you leave this place in search of that riffraff or any other person for that matter. If you walk out of this place, I will disown you. I will cease to be your father. So be it, father. It's your choice to cut all ties with your only child. It is your decision to make that you have done. Iwako. Iwako. I want you to ensure that Kaima does not for any reason leave this palace. Yes, Your Highness. Do I make myself clear? Yes, Your Highness. So you need to hurry and tell me the reason you sent for me because I need to hurry back to the palace. I sneaked out. Well, um, thank you for a job well done. I called the house to appreciate you with a token. Have it. Uh, no, 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 sir. <laughs> sir, I didn't do what I did because of the financial assistance I would get from you. No, I did it because I know how much you love the princess and I want the two of you to be happy. Yeah, even at that, are you trying to reject my token of appreciation. 
I am sorry, sir, but everybody must not leave for the money. I did what I did because I know I need to do it. I'm sorry, so I need to go back to the palace. What shall we do? All people are crying because this is so painful. How dare she reject my token of appreciation? This maid must be mad. Very, very mad. Where have you been? The king has been looking for you. I stepped out to buy something. Hope everything is fine. Look, there will be very good for me. The king has given instruction never to allow Princess Kama leave the palace. He's supposed to be the power. How do we intend to do that? I don't know. We have to be careful. And next time, please, if you want to go out, make sure you tell me. I don't want this kind of problem again, oh, please. Have a fun. Because whom God has chosen cannot be forgotten. Whom God has placed from whom can never be stopped. Princess, she's not in her room and she's nowhere to be found. Princess? Yes. Let me check. Please go and check. Can you see her at all? Wake up, wake up. Princess, she's not in her room and she's nowhere to be found. Hey, don't be Hello, everybody. Ibo is calling all of us. Hey. Come, 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 come. The king is calling us, come. Everybody go. Let's go. Let's go. What is the primary duty of guards in the palace? Your Highness, to protect the king and his entire household. And the maidens? Your Highness, to take care of the chores in the palace and also to be with the princess always. That's correct. You both have answered very well. Now you tell me this. Who aided Kaima's escape from the palace? Your Majesty. Last night, I personally locked the gate and gave the key to Chihuahua. You gave who? Chihuahua. When did you give me the key? 
Chihuahua, when did you give me the key? He gave you the key when he was about using the convenience. That's true. He did. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's true. Then who took the key from me? Who finally took the key from me? I see. You will see where you kept the key. In hell! Chihuahua. Chihuahua. Hey! Why are you so careless? Okay, Chihuahua. 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 So I left to spend the night with Chizoba. I wanted to spend more time with her there. But she's scared of what my father would do to her if he finds out that I'm squatting with her. Lotanna. I am pregnant with your child. I am carrying your baby. My father wanted me to abort this baby. But that is not what I want for myself. He also threatened to disown me if I go looking for you. I don't know. You can move in here with me. Just that you have to lower your standard. No electricity here. No air condition. No bottle water. No maid to serve you. And no car to take you around. So if you are ready to lower your standard, we are together. Those are not my problems. If you can stay here and still be okay, I can manage. <sighs> Father, that's how it happened. Well, son, I'm disappointed in the attitude of my friend, Kimbago, towards all this development. I really don't know what has come over him. Father, I've never been humiliated like this before. I felt so embarrassed. That's my reason for cutting all projects. I mean, they can use us and dump us. They can't use us and dump us. It's not possible. Well, um, in any case, I'll wait for his call. But if he doesn't call, I will call him and tell him my peace of mind. Good. Good, Father. Of course, I know what he can do. <laughs> <laughs> well, son, uh, you know what I can do? Yes. Good. But, uh, son, sincerely speaking, I will tell you something. I've been worried all these days about your attitude and your lifestyle. You're longer growing uh, younger. You're getting old every blessed day. We are still single. I don't know. Father, I step at a time. Okay? I just want to take my time. I want to be sure that there's nothing between I and Princess Kaima anymore. Well, if you say so, no problem. But, uh... Just mind your time. But remember one thing that 
It's reaching time, saves nine. Yes, father. <laughs> Take a drink. <laughs> Condition. Mama, will you stop? It's not like I am sick or something. I am just pregnant. Bam, 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 Mama, that's every woman's dream. Will you stop? Hi. Nothing is wrong with me. That the fact that I am pregnant does not mean I shouldn't do house chores. Stop worrying yourself, Mama. And at the end of the day, I'd, I've always wanted to live this life. Please. And it's here in my presence, so let me leave it, Mama. Please, I don't want anything to happen to you. Mama. It's okay, no problem. Since you insisted, be fast about it so that I can take you back to the king. Yes. Mama, you're wasting your time. You don't know my father. He's a very stubborn man. Uh, good morning. Uh, hello. Good morning. Hey, Povago? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. All okay. right. Good morning. Go, go Good morning. well, my son. Fine. Please, when you get there, make sure you catch a big one. Sure. You get one hour this time. Sure. <laughs> okay. Can I go with you? <clears throat> Not today. Take care. Good luck. Mm. See love. <laughs> ne kwa no love. <laughs> I know you miss him. But he will be back soon. Uh, yeah, exactly. Exactly. So, Mama, as I was saying, what is it? I don't want you to bother yourself about me. My father is a very stubborn man. His words are A and Amen. Nothing on earth can make him change his mind. His beatings are just not good for me, and I'm okay with I'm okay here. But the thing is this. We don't have the luxury to keep you here. Mama, I am not complaining. Have I complained before? I will never complain. It's okay. Come here. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Mama. You're welcome. But about the sweeping, mm. be careful with it. Mama, stop. Jiwayo, I don't want anything to happen to. Oh, Manu. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's begin and continue with what I was doing before I saw you. Oh, Mama. It's all right. <laughs> all right. Uh, Mama, don't run again. No. All right, I'll take it then. <laughs> Not anymore. Please just go there, go and drink. I will call you later. What happened? Where is your car? This is timer. You're crying. Talk to me. What happened? I I left the palace. Okay. I 
I no longer stay there. Why? What happened? My, my father found out I am carrying with a last child. Okay. He asked me to abort it. And? Of course I can't do anything like that. So, but you know me better than anybody. All I've ever wanted is just to have a peaceful and calm life. But my father has never made that possible. Just, just this once that I asked him to let me be with Lotana. He disowned me. He disowned me, Zoba. He disowned you? <sighs> ah, that's rather pathetic. So, what are your plans now? That's why I'm here. So, please. You know you're my only friend. Because I know. I, I don't know. Stop. Please. My presence. Just stop crying. It's okay. I don't know. I don't know if it's... I... I don't know if it will be too much of me to ask. Go ahead and ask. What is it? So, Ba. Yes, dear. I've come to beg you. So that you can at least teach me what you do. I am begging you, please. Is that what you're begging me? What are friends for? You know I can do anything for you. I can teach you. You want to start today? I just want you to stop crying, okay? Don't forget, you're still my princess. Stop. Thank you. It's okay. Thank you very much. Stop crying. I don't want my guests to notice that you're crying. I'm tired of this work. I'm thinking of quitting this job. So what will you now do if you quit your job as a palace maid? I don't know. I have option. I'm thinking on the best. Since the princess left, the palace hasn't been the same. And me, I'm thinking on sending my resignation. I think the king will approve of that. I don't know yet. I will give you a try. I mean, you need to back and go too much. Don't ask me what I intend to do for a living because I won't tell you. You know. Better. Thank you. Don't tell her. Only I should. It's all going to go. Someone can have something. You answer. The palace is favorable and fun to work at this time. You know? All right, but why do you say so? Can't you see? It's obvious. We do less work and we eat and we drink. Ooh, yeah! I think you're correct. Yeah, that's all wrong. Oh, you eat and drink at quick. Is that what you call it? Eating and drinking at will. How else do you want me to explain what is happening here? If not this palatable kind of enjoyment? Listen, let me tell you. The palace has lost its 
Is it not obvious that the palace has lost its form? Since that guy took the princess away, the palace is come over to this. People are here, marrying and drinking. Oh, I think, I think you're right. But it is very obvious that the king has not been happy. Just listen up, friend. Nobody, I mean, nobody can change what is happening in the palace at this time. So let us eat, drink, and enjoy ourselves while it lasts. Nobody! <laughs> what you do is eat, drink, <laughs> enjoy yourself while it lasts. I'll be making food. Say, wow, wow, nothing will roam anywhere. Hmm? Enjoy yourself. It's, it's wow. harsh. It's <laughs> harsh. Whatever you drink. Enjoy. You know, I'm not a drunk guy. Like, you know, like, yeah. <laughs> Say, wow, wow. <laughs> um, I want to assure all of you that as far as I'm concerned, each and every one of you is here on his or her own volition. We are not forcing anybody to remain in service. You are here because you want to be here and because you enjoy being here. And you're out because there is something you want to do outside. Any day you want to call it quits, you are completely free. So right now, if any one of you wishes to call it quits, indicate by raising up your hand. Well, no one of you. That's good. Neka wants to call it quits. She wants to end her service with the royal family. And we must bid her well. Neka, step forward. You have been of service to this royal house. And you will go in peace. Same. Uh, we wish you well, yes, sir. you have seen service and you've seen joy. When you leave, you will also see happiness. You will see joy. Yes, sir. Whatever you put your hands on will prosper. Yes, sir. And your life will be meaningful. Yes, sir. Go in peace. All right. So, try this one. Oh, we just come in. Yeah, you like it? I love it. Thank you so much. You're yeah, welcome. <laughs> See, I want to thank you for everything you have been doing for me. Thank you. So tell me, what exactly is going on? Relax. I just want to know you. Who is a maker? <laughs> just the same way I want to know who is friend. Okay. Um, as you know, my name is Fred. And I'm the only child of uh, the great Mwachuku. You can say I was born with a silver spoon. I lost my mom a long time ago, and each time I remember her, I cry a lot. Oh, so sorry. I'm very sorry. It's okay. I can be best described as a spoiled brat. You know, being so egoistic hasn't taken me far in life, so I learned in a hard way. I decided to be humble. You know, I passed through a lot of things with Princess Kaima. And I wouldn't want to make such a mistake again. Well, I don't understand the whole thing. You asked me to resign as a palace maiden and promised to get me a good and lucrative job. So. Yes, you're resigning from the palace. 
is the reason why we're here. This is the purpose. You know, I've decided to do most of the things I didn't do for Princess Kaima. You know, so I decided to take you for shopping, you know. Those are the things my ego didn't allow me to do while dating her. See, I want you by my side every now and then. <laughs> do you really want to marry me? Yes, I want to marry you. I love you. Yeah. See, I am an orphan. I don't have anybody to speak for me. If you love me the way you, you just told me now, you need to protect me for I don't have any other person to speak for me. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'll treat you like a queen you are. All right? Dad. <laughs> Fred. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine, Dad. Oh, oh, I thought I could just see. Yes, yes, Dad. Yeah. Thank you. Ah, so, Dad. This is the bright morning star you requested. You know, you always told me I'm growing old and all of that. Of course, I promise to oblige to your request. Her name is Neka. Neka meets my father. Distinguished Senator of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Senator Mwachiku, my own father. It's my pleasure, sir. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, um, Neka, you are welcome to my home. Thank you so much, sir. <laughs> sir, you see, um, your son here, Fred, has told me a whole lot of beautiful things about you. <laughs> and I must say that you fit everything that he said. <laughs> You see, Fred is my only son. In fact, he's the chief of the old block. Well, uh, he has fallen in love with you. And uh, he has chosen you as his bride. But I don't really know. No opinion about that. Sir, uh, Fred and I are in love with each other. And he has asked me to be his wife and I have accepted. I love your son so much. Oh, what are we waiting for? Fred? <laughs> I'm so happy with the choice of a woman. Neka, you are welcome to my home. Thank you so much, sir. Well, start making your plans. Because I'm in support of that. Well, uh, we're making your plans. Don't forget to put me in view. Well, Father, just want to thank you especially for supporting me. And of course, looking out for me every now and then. Don't worry, so don't worry. And my next word, I will choose yours, my Oh, that would be a nice too. Well, Thank both you of so you are welcome. Thank you. All right. Thank you. <laughs> so, yeah. Darling, uh, come, come, let me show you okay. where you need to live off. This house. Thank you, sir. All right. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> All right, sir. Come, come, come. come, come. <sighs> How was it? Well, it went well, though. Can you believe it? It went well. It's just that the surgery to the process that should be doing some exercise. Did I really put up some weight? Not that much. But it's expected. Yes, as a pregnant woman, you need to add weight in some places. <laughs> but not much. Okay, but uh, Mama. The doctor even said I can do some exercise to help. Eh? Hey. Yes, what are they? Hey, not really hard exercise. Though. Like all these youngest of nowadays who want to become slim. You don't need that time. All you need to do is to walk around the compound. Eh? Hey, gradually, systematically. Oh, you understand? Yes, hey, don't force it. Then you lose weight. <laughs> but yeah, I, I prepared something for you to eat. Oh? Okay. Why? 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 Why?
So my daughter, that is all you have to know about um, various types of fish and their prices. Mama, mm -hmm. the lecture is too many. <laughs> ah, ah. The way you lecture me today, it's too plenty. Hey. Hey. But these are the things, little, little things you have to know. I've learned them and I am good. grateful. Good, good, good. Thank you, Mama. I need You're to welcome. go now so that I can go to the market and sell them. Who knows? Luck will shine on me. You want to go to the market? Why not? Hey, Bano. How do you want my son to feel? No, 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 no. He will not be happy about this journey that you want to embark on. No. What if something happened to you? Mama, nothing will happen to me. Eh? It's because Lutana will not let me. That's why I want to do it on my own. Mama, don't you pity for him? I do. Lutana is suffering too much to put food on our table. Instead of sitting down lazy in about, let me get busy. Let me be useful for once. And maybe that's the only way I can support him. It's okay. It's okay. Since you are insisting, you know, I will let you go on one condition. That you... You don't buy, you go I buy want to home. live my life. Simple life. Buy fish here. Not as a princess. Not as one. Well. Oh, Mama. Mama, I know cause this one on Mama, how much you won't buy? How much you won't buy? Tell me. How much you won't buy? How much you won't buy? How much you won't buy? How much you won't sell? 500. 500. Mama, the fish, the salmon, the fish is fresh. Are you fresh now? But now it costs. Because, you know, 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 we say 700. Mama, bring 1,000. 700 I they pay. 700 Naira. Mama, bring Mama, bring Let me put them correct, oh. Complete, Mama. I never cheated before now. I need freedom. Not light. That does not suit my sin. Thank you, Mama. Bye, sister. Oh, Mama, I don't come. Today, I'll make sense. Where, where? Bye, fish here. Yeah. Let me be. Let me be. Bye, fish here. Yeah. Oh, my God, Mama. Let me be. Ah. Bye, fish, yeah. Let's be. It's my Bye, fish, yeah. Mama, don't come today. Oh. Let's be. Bye, woman. Uh, let's be. You know, say, anytime I want to come by your shop like this, I can go house. Let's be. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Let's be. I they said today. Oh. Mama, today will make sense. So. I see as my husband bring and I saw the roaster with your hand. They are very fine. Mama, we are one to Come on, I'm going to go. 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 i am going to go i am going to
When I come, she said you work at Komot. I go market. I am Mama Siam now. I'm going to eat all this fish. Mama, you see, said the fish don't finish. Mama, just help you bend. Yeah. Don't try. Mama, not if you bend though. Yeah, no, we help you. This one is 400. This one is 500. Ah, you must learn to learn. Today, yeah, mama, how much you want buy? Yeah. Ma, go food for my husband. Yeah, give me the two, five hundred now. Huh? Yeah. Ah? Yeah. 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 I beg. Five and two, five. Give me a little my head too. Yeah. I don't say you don't try. Mama, next yeah. time you know go buy like this. Yeah, no worry. Yeah. You did try, my dear. Mm -hmm. Huh? You did try. Mm -hmm. So you do this thing to help your husband. Mm -hmm. Or say you be princess. Mm -hmm. You did try, though. Thank my you, my I agree that you're fine picking, though, eh? No problem. Not like Thank you, Mama. Let's see you next time, yeah? Okay, Mama. Please, let me know. Ah, no problem, see the put out. Mama, these boys, they snatch my things anyhow. Yeah. They collect them like this. Hard Mama, see you next time, eh? My dear, why would the princess be hawking buy fish in the market? And oh, she's even happily doing it too. Hmm. Yeah. She's a good woman now. Wife material. Despite the fact that it brings her down as a princess, she's still doing it very happy. Okay, let's leave that one. Madam, slice with you. She's on her wife material for uh -huh. 100 years. I wish I can be like her. Let's go. Madam, you need me. Yes, my daughter. Where is the lever? All right, one. All right, one. Customer. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, Ah, it's too cost, so. Not be 500. I get 500. Which one can be 500? Oh, yeah, give me that one. I don't know what to they call them. Goosey. Yeah, Goosey, guess what they give me for soup. My husband, they like and wear well. Hello, Igwe. Your Majesty. I just want to be sure that the person I'm seeing in the market is not Princess Kaima. Hmm. May well have been the person you're talking about. Ah. No! No maid following her, no guard, nothing. No royal beads, no royal attire. And she's here. She's even carrying a tray as if she has just finished walking and buying something. 
I am seeing her now. And she's heavily pregnant. Obidimo. Mamzani Dua for Kotele Kia Akampa. My daughter feels she has grown and she can take decisions. Well, she has taken her own decision. Yes. She left my house, the palace, without my prompting and against my will. Let her taste the other side of life. Obidibo. She's no longer my daughter. Don't talk like that, Your Majesty. Please, not, everybody knows that it's your daughter. Everyone knows that Kaima is your daughter. Please. I do not want to entertain any more calls. Do not call me on this particular. Uh, no, uh, Your Majesty. Hello, Igwe. Hello. Hello. There are complications in her pregnancy. 
because he did not go through prenatal care. What is that supposed to mean, Doctor? What are we supposed to do? Well, what it means is that she has to deliver through cesarean operation. What? Yes. Operation? Yes. Sorry, Doctor. Is that the only option? I don't want her to deliver through operation. Operation is the safest thing in this very situation. It is the safest way to deliver under the circumstances. Nothing else is better. Okay, sir. If that is the only way forward, no problem. We can commence with the operation. I just want her to deliver. I just want her to put to bed safely. Uh, well, uh, not so fast. We're going to need the sum of 650,000 naira for the operation to commence. Sorry, sir. How much? 650,000 naira only. 65,000 or 750,000? Come on, the turn now. <laughs> that is the standard price. Uh, as a matter of fact, it is the, it's the barest minimum. And I'm actually considering your situation. Sir, please, what was the last price? What was the last price for people my age? I just told you the barest minimum. For some other patients, it could be much, much higher than that. 650,000 naira. Yes, it's a cesarean operation. Do you know the standard of this hospital? Okay, 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 okay. Just, um, okay, no problem. If that is the only way forward, you can start the operation while I go and run around for more. No, no, no. It does not work that way. You better start running around immediately because without the money, we're not going to commence any operation. What? The earlier, the better. Don't forget two lives are involved. Mother and our one baby. said she would deliver through CS. Hey! Huh? That I should go and look for 650,000 more. 650,000 more? You know, add the earlier the better. Ne are basically getting what they got. Where are we going to get such amount from now? Hey! What? Why didn't you price? Yes. She's price now, like 50,000, 70,000. What would you get away? Don't you know these people and how they bill? Once hey. they pronounce their bill, once they print it, they don't even make amends. I've begged that man, he said no, that I must bring 650,000 naira before they can start operating on her. Uh, uh, the earlier the better. That's uh, what is, what's really making me uncomfortable. I think, I think the main thing now is to start looking for how to raise this money. Maybe uh, not anyhow, can't you call your friends? Even um, Kaima's father, let us try, please. Call who? Your friends. Your friends now. Look at me. Do I look like someone that has a friend that can raise 650,000 naira under one hour? Do they write it on their face or on their body? Uh, thank you. They, they might have it, they, they, won't, they won't show you. They won't make you understand that they have such, such amount in, in, in their estate. This is suicidal. We don't see if we have anything. They're not suicidal. suicidal if anything ugly should happen to her. Exactly. Please, they just hurry, please. Hey, Amma. Let me go to I was told uh, you wanted to see and that is some emergency. Yes, Your Highness. Shoot. Your Highness, it's an emergency. Emergency? Yes, Your Highness. It has to do with life and death. Yes, Your Highness. 
Emma. It's about your daughter, Kaima. As we speak right now, she's in the hospital about to give birth. But the doctor says she can only deliver with tears. And is asking for 600,000 naira. We are asked to deposit 350,000 before the operation will be carried out. Your Highness, that is why we are here. Is that why both of you are here? Oh, you, are you here for something else? No, Your Highness, it's for the same reason. I want to clarify the situation for the interest of both of you, and I want you to listen very well. Okay, Your Highness. Kaima ceased to be my daughter. The very day he, she disobeyed me, walked out of this palace on her own volition. Without my prompting, I did not ask her to leave. It's not as if I did not know how to or where to find her. But I allowed her. I allowed her to go and take a decision I allowed her to go and follow her heart on one condition. That I will cease to be her father. Your Highness, please forgive her. She is only a child. <sighs> When a child disobeys the parents, the, the, the parents can beat the child with one hand and they pet the child with the other hand. Please forgive her, please, Your Highness. Who are you? Who are you to two Tommy on how to treat a stubborn child? No, 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 no. Your, your Highness, no. We, we are not to change. If you loved her that much, why didn't you source the money and pay? Pay the bill. Pay the hospital bill. Instead of coming here to disturb me. And you don't, you know, you don't have that right. I do not ever want to be disturbed with this. By the way, what are you doing? I, I am the, the mother-in-law. Lotanna is my son. Your faithful servant. He is mine. I see. I want to take two counts. By the end of the two counts, I want both of you out of this panel. I start counting now. One!
sorry, there's none from me. I'm, I'm still in shock. I don't understand. He asked us to leave immediately. He realized Mama is your biological mother. Hi. I don't want anything to happen to her and my unborn child. What do we do now? Or say we? Did you just say we? How? Am I the one that got her pregnant? Are you the one that got her pregnant? Or say we? Can call the alcohol? Mama, we please, that. please, Mama, please. There's no point abortioning blames right now. Let's just go and meet Ono Wu Obidibu. He's the Igwe's right man hand. He, he, will, he, will, he, will, he will listen to him. I don't think he would listen to us, considering the controversy surrounding the pregnancy. No, 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 no. I, th I think she's right. Meet the Ono Wu. Ono Wu can speak to the king to listen to him. I hate being in this type of situation. I hate being in this type of situation. Before you get pregnant, ask for approval. Mama, you, 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 so you ask for approval. Oh, oh. Mama, eh? I, think, I think Antonia is right. I think he's right. You go and meet him. Go and meet Ono. Maka, can I say? At least he will consider your age. age. Yeah? Okay. I think, I think you're right. Yeah, I, just, I, just, I, just try. I'll try, try now, whichever way. Just let, don't have okay, time. I will don't try. have time. I will try. I will try. I will try. I will try. Let me. Hey, Gumwa. Hello. This one, your free picking up there, was it? Oh, no, all is not well. All is not well at all. What happened? It's, it's about our princess, Princess Kaima. Huh? What happened to her? <laughs> She's in labor and about to give birth through cesarean operation. The doctor said we should pay the sum of 650,000 naira before the operation will be carried out. But an initial deposit of 350,000 naira must be paid before the operation will be done. And why did you choose to come to me instead of going straight to the palace to see? Oh, oh no, we have been there. We have been there, but the, 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 the king chased us away. He asked us never to come back again. Yes. Serious. Okay, have you been able to raise anything? Nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing. That is why I'm here. Oh no, nothing. We don't have anything as I speak with you right now. Sorry. It's okay. Huh? If 650,000 naira. It's what is needed to save our life and that of our baby. Then I have to go to the palace and see the king. Hey, but can I stand to busy? Hi. Hey. Hey. Oh, thank you so much. No, no, no. Thank you. Hey, go thank rise, you so rise, rise. Thank you so much, man. May the gods of our Lord bless you. May the gods of our Lord bless just you. Rise first. Thank you. Hey. Um, oh no, please, when you get to the palace. Uh, I'm on the point that uh, life is involved here. Uh, two lives, as a matter of fact, two lives is involved. Please, please. I will say that I'm too busy. I will go because I'm too busy. Okay. But then, are you trying to put words in my mouth? No, no, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. No, no, not at all. Don't not at all. Go handle the king. Okay. Mm? Thank you very much. Go back and take care of her. Alright. Hi! I, I have to be on my way now. It's okay. Thank you so much. It's okay. How is the king going to say? Igwe. Um, oh no. This one you <laughs> you are just coming in and uh, I'm all dressed and ready to go out. I, I hope all is well. All is not too well, Your Majesty. That is fire on the mountain. In fact, this is a matter of life and death. And this time around, two lives are involved. This is serious. Which lives could that be? Your Majesty, your daughter, Princess Kaima. Kaima's pregnancy is getting more complicated. And now, as a matter of urgency, 650,000 naira is required to carry out a CS on her to avoid losing her life and that of her child. 
your grandchild. Oh, no. You are one of the foremost custodians of customs and traditions of this community. Oh, no, if you were not my right hand man, I would have accused you of conspiring with Kaima to escape from this palace. You were. Oh no. You've ridiculed yourself to a mere messenger. If the young man who is responsible for Kaima's pregnancy is man enough, he would have been here himself. Now listen to me. You go tell him to go and see his father-in-law. Not as your majesty. Where are these boys? 